Hi, Adrian. Welcome in. Can we get some yos? Hello. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me, but hello. Welcome in. Hi, Chris. Hi, Kobobo. Also, whenever I click out of the game, the music mutes itself, so I can't do anything. <laughs> Watching the stream on mute? <laughs> oh, no. Guys, somebody has to, um... Wait, Kobo, you can put captions on through your phone. New tweet, new tweet. Sorry, I keep clicking out of the game. <laughs> there it goes back. Just kidding. <laughs> yeah, I really wish the game wouldn't mute. I don't know why it's doing that. I probably have to adjust like my system settings, but too late for that. Guys, we're live. Because you're windowed is that really how it works oh wait maybe wait maybe if i capture the audio from the window hold i need to add a new audio source how do i do that okay i will guys the music is playing imagine it in your heads Oh my god, hi, Wolf! Hello! Okay, wait, I'm figuring out how to do it. I'm figuring it out. Oh, it's- it's- okay, okay. I think I know what I need to do. Yeah, finally got to see you, Adrian. Can I ask where you found the channel? Okay, let me... <laughs> hey, yo, a TikTok frog? Ain't no way. We love TikTok. Dude, I almost clicked stop streaming. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Proper properties? Okay, I know, I know how to do it. Let let's just put the music back on for now. Okay. Un segundo, por favor. I'm glad you like the clips, man. Okay, let's. I'll figure it out in a second. I'll figure it out in a second. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Oh, oh the music is playing. Okay. <laughs> okay, hello. Good evening, good afternoon, hope everyone is doing well today. Rare stream, everybody, rare stream. I'm finally live, rare weekend stream. Um, if you guys follow my Twitter, you guys know I've not been feeling the best, so I feel a lot better today. I don't know, I think it's because I tried biking too much. So, I, I think I, like, broke my body. I think I literally broke my body, because, like... Wednesday, Thursday, my legs were like dead. They were dead. I could barely fucking walk. But I'm fine now. Context, I'm disabled. 
Um, but I feel a lot better today. I went out to see a movie last night with my sister and my roommate. We saw the new Elemental. I will be posting a full review later today on Twitter. So everybody go follow my Twitter. Um, at Peace in 17, no underscore. Um, so that was the past few days. <laughs> but I'm feeling better today. We're gonna be doing Sort the Chord. I remember watching Markiplier play this years ago. Um, it's a Unity-based game, so I was able to download it. So I'm playing it off my computer. So, that's what we're doing today. A bonus sub-goal stream from ages ago. Um, I will figure out how to capture the audio right now, okay? So, I think now that it's in this layer, I can capture it properly now. I wonder how I add a source, because... It's capturing- I know how to do this, don't worry, I know how to do this. Okay, wait. Let's see. Capture method. No, I know I know how to do this because I used to capture audio by tab, but I forgot. Okay, it's fine. I I don't need to figure it out. It's okay. It's fine. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> okay, I just have to not click off the screen. Okay, so... I just have to post on IG really quick that I'm live. Guys, I haven't streamed in three days. I need to get back in the group. Oh, also, who had a three-day weekend? Because I know it's Juneteenth on Monday. Um, my sister still has to work, Sag. Because it's technically a federal holiday now. You went to work? No, Juneteenth is Monday, man. Today is Saturday. It's Saturday. <laughs> Dude, it's so jarring hearing the music cut out. Also, um, back to full cam. Wait, I should just make use my hockeys. The same man. Oh yeah, the kids probably have. Hi mom. Where'd it go? Oh, today for the RP, I have a scepter. I made this this morning hastily with my sister. Um, so it's like a little candy tube, and then we wrapped it in the gold wrapping paper from Christmas, and it's an ornament. <laughs> it's like, it so this is the RP today. Guys, I am now royalty. <laughs> I am now royalty. I have obtained a lovely property. As you can see above, that is my front yard. Hashtag real, hashtag not clickbait. I am now a queen. You gotta marry a cousin? No, all my cousins are way too old. They're either babies or literally 40. I ain't fucking no cousins. We need an emote for this? You can do peace I do pride, that works. Okay, so how Sword the Court works is you are the king or the queen of a kingdom. And you must make the decisions that are for the best of your kingdom. Okay, so let's start a new game. I was- I started a new game just to test out audio, so it's fine. I am a queen! Okay. Now you guys have to help me make decisions. So you can use the- The say yay or say nay twitch emotes, I think, if you want. <laughs> okay. I'm also gonna try and do voices. Th this is gonna be so- th This is gonna give me like an arm workout holding this. Okay, I also have a little bowl of fruit because, you know, royalty, we get the good shit. And also, watermelon was on sale at the shop. Ooh, I had a hard seat. Okay. Now, let us continue. <clears throat> I'm gonna hold this in this hand because <laughs> my keyboard is here to the left. Royal advisor. My lady, I'll help you rule your kingdom, but you have to make the tough choices. Say yes. Just say yes or no. Understand? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Good. You've already got the hang of it. 
Our city's still very small right now, but it certainly has the potential to grow. Perhaps one day you will have a bustling metropolis, and you will be invited to join the Council of Crowns. Why then name? All she's 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 just talking. For now, all you need to concern yourself with is keeping the citizens happy and growing our population. Do your best, madam. Okay, growing the population does not mean banging our cousins. Don't worry. Do not worry. <laughs> that will not be done. I'm just lowering the music a bit for me. Oh, that's better. Hey, Georgie. You interested in making a deal, bub? Your people's souls in exchange for my gold. How about it? Um, I'm a socialist, and I don't believe in sacrifices, so no, I think I'm good, Georgie. Mm -mm. Hey, I'll get you next time, buddy. Witch. The spirits are appeased right now, but perhaps we should grant them an offering of gold. I know the spirit world always appreciates gold, and it might prevent them from haunting us in the future. What do you say? 200 gold would make a decent offering. Now... I don't believe in ghosts, but whenever people use the word spirits, I get more scared. Because... To me, that's more like personable, more like human than a ghost. So... Hmm... 200 gold is literally all my money, though. All of my citizens' taxable dollars. I honestly, I'd rather spend money on infrastructure than conspiracy. So I'm gonna say no. Mm -mm. Nothing for now, then. I'll let you know if anything changes with the spirit world. Hi, Kim. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? <laughs> Kelly. Any monsters afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fay if you're interested. Hmm. I do believe in castle security. No, a cab. This is not a cop. Don't worry, a cab. Um, I don't like monsters. Mm -hmm. No, he's in mysteries, not monsters. Oh, dude, did I misread it? It's fine. It's fine. It's just ten bucks. I'll uncover the truth. Then report back to you. Mason. <laughs> he looks like a little kid. We- I do not condone child labor. I did not hire this child. Mason. I wish to construct a tavern, but I'll need some gold from you to make it happen. I'm taking a considerable amount of gold. Here. Like a couple hundred at least. What do you think? I only have 190, bud. A tavern would bring in more people, more tourism. But I only got 190. I'd rather invest, but this is kind of like infrastructure. I'm not a lib, I'm gonna say no. Mm -hmm. I'm not a lib. Man, I guess I'll cancel our plans. Sorry, Mason. Ooh, day one complete. Population plus zero, happiness minus one, wealth minus 10. People are sad. The city is shrinking. Dude, it's day one, give me a break. Sneaky girl. Want me to steal from the rich and give it to you? Not just the rich, I'll steal from whoever, basically. Hmm. I've never seen the fox- No, that's the wrong movie. <laughs> I was gonna say Fox and the Hound. <laughs> What's the one- Robin Hood? What's it- Is it called Robin Hood? I only watched the one that has the guy from The Princess Bride. I never saw the animated one. And I don't believe in vigilante action. I think it's bad. Okay, it's, they said I'll steal from the rich and then also the poor. I'm a kind, benevolent leader. And if, if word comes out, if any of you guys snitch that I hired a vigilante to steal money from you guys, that would cause an insurrection. So I'm gonna say no. Mm -mm. Taking the high road, huh? I'll see you around. Holy! Gardener. Plants are interesting, don't you think? I would like to open a garden. May I have some workers to help me? Yeah, why not? We love infrastructure. Mm -hmm. Tourism. 
because she's hot. Give her what she wants. That's what you said, not what I said. I'm just quoting a chatter. Thank you. I will send them back as soon as they're done. LD34. Ha, ha, hello. I am serial number LD34. Point CC. Can you fix me? Yeah. I believe in... Um... Automation? A <laughs> <laughs> hundred dollars! Oh no. It's over. It's... That was bad. Thanks, friend. I am become fixed. But he didn't tell me how much it would cost. Mason. I wish to construct a tavern, but I'll need some gold for you to make it happen. I'm taking a considerable amount of gold. Like, a couple hundred at least. I- You asked the same thing yesterday. I'm still gonna say no. Mm -mm. Man, I guess I'll cancel our plans. Monsieur Espirit. Hmm. You call this a castle? Yes, sir. Mm. Look at the picture. Indeed it is. Trick question. Smartass. Get out of here. Okay, day two complete. Population minus three, happiness plus five, and wealth minus a hundred. People are happy. The city is growing. <laughs> Low fang. <laughs> Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah, why not? I love magic. Mm -hmm. Holy! I see. Fame and fortune for you. Go! Free money. Why can't all psychics do that? Skelly. Reporting in, I managed to catch the necromancer behind a recent string of possessions. She's behind bars now, at least until she learns her lesson. It's on the up and up, baby. Chester. Dude, it's from Dark Souls. I've never played Dark Souls, but I remember watching, like, clips of, like, Markiplier or PewDiePie freaking out. I have watermelon. Hey, Chester. I accidentally ate some folks off front. Can I just pay you back with gold? Between you and me, between you and me, man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh no, wait! He okay, no, it said he already ate them. But look, it just subtracted five people. He did not say I will pay you to eat your civilians. He said he already ate them. Thanks for understanding. Dude, that's bullshit. That's not that's not what I meant to do. I'm sorry. Mulder. Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're gonna wanna hire me. I love spies. Mm -hmm. Oh, ten dollars? Okay. Not bad, not bad. I'm gonna go investigate something. Royal Advisor. There's a petition going around to open our borders to the neighboring town. What do you say? Yeah, we love immigration. Mm -hmm. oh, 30 people, more laborers. Together, our towns will grow stronger. Day three complete. Population plus 25, happiness plus 17, my favorite number. And wealth plus 240. People are happy and the city is growing. Okay, this crown is giving me a headache. <laughs> oh, I will give my full review on the Elemental movie, but it, it alludes so much to the immigrant story and lived experience in the States. It's so on the nose. Okay, back to work. Sneaky girl. Want me to steal from the rich and give to you? 
Not just the rich, I'll steal from whoever, basically. No! Mm -mm, no. Taking the high road, huh? I'll see you around. I'm, s I'm never going to say yes to you. Just don't come back. Mulder. I'm back. I discovered an alien conspiracy to cover up large amounts of gold. Do you believe in aliens? Yeah, obviously. It... Out of all the conspiracy, aliens to me is the most believable. Like, just RNG-wise. You get to know there are other believers out there. He's probably an alien himself. Look at him. Chester. You ever see a treasure chest do a... Backflip? No, I haven't. Mm -mm. Well, you're not gonna. What? He's trying to be the court jester so bad. Chicken. Block, block, block! I think it's just here to pay a visit. Should we leave it be? Oh, the, the chicken. Okay. Yeah. It could be tomorrow's dinner. Block, left behind an egg. The witch. The spirits are appeased right now, but perhaps we should grant them an offering of gold. I know the spirit world always appreciates gold, and it might prevent them from haunting us in the future. What do you say? Two hundred gold would make a decent offering. I have 383, and the guy who wants to make a tavern, he's probably not going to come by the rest of the day. So now that I have a bit more money, I will invest in the dark arts. Mm -hmm. I'll conduct a ceremony and offer this to the spirit world. Ooh, day four complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus zero, wealth minus 147. People are happy, and the city is growing. Okay, yeah, this crown really hurts. <laughs> Cause like the crown is like this big and it stretches. Not like anything else, don't worry. But this was like a this was the cheapest accessory they had at the Spirit Halloween store. It was like a it was four dollars. Get back to work. Now I've been awakened and I'm crushing it. <laughs> Butler. My lady, there's a man in the foyer asking to join your guard. He's got an eye patch. Looks a little shifty. What do you think? Should we take a chance on the stranger? Yeah, why not? I don't discriminate. I don't hate. Mm -hmm. Indeed, more swords will help us. Madame Abiel. Bonjour, my name is Madame Abiel, and I've come to join your court. Will you have me? Oh, yes, sir. Mm-hmm. How sweet! I'm sure many wonderful adventures await us. Yeah, she's cute, but she's not hot. <laughs> Which? There's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slay them for a few gold coins if you want. Did she summon the goblins just so I can pay her to exterminate them? Conspiracy. I'll do this one time. Mm -hmm. Oh, ten. Okay, not bad. I'll show those creeps. Little Fang. I'm the Duke of Spook. Do you want a spooky nickname? Sure. Sure. Mm hmm. Hmm. You can be. The Creep Queen. Yet, yet. Mom says I need your permission to go on an adventure. So can I? Please? Please? Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. You have the Queen's... You have the Queen's blessing. Yay, I'm so excited to go exploring. 
Oh, day five complete. Population plus two, happiness plus seven, wealth minus ten. People are happy and the city is growing. So apparently this game is endless. So guys, we're gonna stream forever. <laughs> Pancake. I'm not saying it. This cat seems slightly magical. Not sure what it wants, though. I would die if I had a cat. Like, actually. Mm hmm I guess that's good? If I had a castle, I would fill it with cats. How come you don't make animal sounds? K-I-N-K shit! You know, Mac. You know the drill. seeing eye. It's just staring at me. Does it want something? What just happened? I feel unlucky. Yeah, minus 100. He robbed me. Guards? Guards, get him. <laughs> Night. My lady, I wish to embark upon a treacherous quest. Yeah, go get the grill, I guess. For the kingdom! I shall return to you, lady! It is your queen? I'm not but a lady. Kelly. Any mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fee, if you're interested. Yeah, do a little snooping. I'll uncover the truth and report back to you. Royal advisor. My lady, a man wishes to settle a dispute. He says he is way cool, but his friend says he is not. Do you think he is cool? Yeah, everybody's wicked here. Mm -hmm. I'm sure he'll be happy to hear that. Guards say somebody was eaten by an enchanted treasure chest of some variety in the middle of the night. Okay, that is not my fault. That is not my fault. Gossip is spreading around about a heroic purple witch slaying goblins in the lower quarter. He's become something of a folk hero. Ooh, lore update. Population minus one, happiness plus seven. And wealth minus 110. People are happy and the city is growing. You know what else can increase my town's happiness? Following the channel. Because everybody, we are 30 minutes into the stream. So if you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Can we hit our daily goal? They're thriving. I mean, our town is very small. We only have 180 people. So we are going to have an incest problem. I do wonder what the population size were for, like, medieval times. Like, were they as small as, like, middle of nowhere towns in, like, Alabama or something? Get back to work. Oh, he's- oh, I thought he was holding a heart, but he's holding a book. Petite Saurus. There's a mouse. Should we chase it away? No, he looks like an educated fellow. We'll- we'll let him stick around. Mm -hmm. Phew, it's gone. Little Fang. You failing. Spooky today? Yes, sir? Mm -hmm. Heck yeah, let the blood flow. Why did that lower my population? Did he merc somebody? It's that slightly magical cat from before. Does this mean we're friends now? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I guess we are. Yeah, you can hang on her all day. I would love that. Miriam. Oh ho. What is this strange place I found myself in? Albert, do you know where we are? 
My, oh my! Hello, you queenly person there! I do believe I am quite lost. Might I stay in this town for a while? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sure. Oh, nice. Albert and I shall find an inn to stay at. I'm sure I will see you again. Albert seems to like you. You can see in the background, too, there's more, like, buildings being added, too. Our town is growing. Madame Abiel. Bonjour! I just finished moving in, but I would like to request an assistant of my own. May I have, uh, to one person? Yeah. I'm giving... I'm giving the population jobs. Mm-hmm. Thank you, my sweet. What does she do? Like, does she murk them? Like, her assistant still has to live here, right? A okay, day seven complete. Population minus one, happiness plus one, and wealth plus zero. People are happy and the city is growing. It's that slightly magical cat from before. Does this mean we're friends now? Obvi, mm -hmm. we're besties. I guess we are. The wizard. I was just passing through when thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Why not? Mm -hmm. I love magic. There we go. Ho oh, ho A spell of great fortune. Sorry, I, I got a desktop alert and I thought it was my CPU burning itself. Yet, yet, I'm back. I found these shiny yellow stones. Pretty cool, right? Yeah, give them to me. Mm -hmm. Give them to me. So cool. Dude, plus 60. Easy. We robbed a child. Royal advisor. People have started a petition to ban pineapples in the city. Should we do it? Why, though? Pineapples are delicious? They are kind of sharp, and I guess if you checked it at somebody, it could be a weapon. I do have an assault weapons ban in my kingdom. But I don't... Why don't they like pineapples? But I... If I don't let them do the petition, then they're gonna be very sad. But then I don't want my city folk to be delusional and ban silly things that should not be banned. Like, we're excluding a whole market if we ban pineapples. Hmm, peace I too. Hmm. I'll side with my people. Mm -hmm. The pineapple trade will suffer, but the people demand it. Why though? Wait, did I just do sanctions? Reporting in. I figured out a mysterious new way to make gold. Want to know how? Obviously. Mm -hmm. I'm not telling you. <laughs> Ban him. Banish him to the netherworld. Day 8 complete. Population plus 0, happiness plus 9, and wealth plus 300. The people are happy and the city is growing. The all-seeing eye. It's just staring at me. Does it want something? Mm -hmm. Don't- don't- okay, he did not steal. What just happened? I feel lucky? It probably alternates. Hmm. Military general. We captured some foes on the battlefield. Shall we bring them home and put them to work? Ooh. Prisoners of war. Hmm. But what are you gonna do if you don't capture them? Like, are you just gonna put them to sleep? Wink?
I feel like if I say no, he's just gonna like slit their throats right in front of me. And I don't want to clean up that mess. So, they can be in prison, work for a little while, and then I'll free them. Mm -hmm. We'll get them into town then. C plus A population. Prisoners still count towards per capita population. Royal advisor. Since we opened our borders, trade from our caravans has increased dramatically. Do you wish to tax the merchants? Oh. There has been no tax question so far. Hmm, peace I too. Hmm. But I think it's funny that we're only taxing them now that it's profitable. But technically the merchants... Oh wait, are they the merchants living here or not living here? You know what? I need to have money that way I can pay for the roads and shit, so yes, I will tax them. Mm -hmm. I will collect the fee from the traders. I don't care if you're not happy. Fuck the libs. I will tax you till you're dead. LD34. I am quite sorry about earlier. My circuits were quite fried. I offer my thanks for your help. Yeah, no problem, man. I see you got legs now. That's cool. Plus 100, baby. Quite logical. So he paid me back. Butler. <laughs> Might I get a cup for you? Might I get a cup of tea for you, my lady? Is he trying to poison me? It is quite late in the day for a cup of tea. It is near my bedtime. And I guzzle down melatonin, not tea, before bed. You know this, butler. If I take a sip of this and I die, you will be forever banished. Aha, mm -hmm. uh -huh, yes. Nice and hot, madame. Ooh. Lore update. The workers were captured, or the workers we captured and recruited have sped up our building processes, resulting in more tax income. Yeah, because it's slave labor. Day 9 complete. Population plus 8. Happiness plus 4. Wealth plus 317. People are happy and the city is growing. Guys, we are on track to be the best kingdom that has ever been made. And you guys are part of it. Yes, sir. Yeah, I got an email. I gotta check it. I only have a week and two days left of school. Dude, watermelon is so good. It's not filling at all, though. How I feel about that? About the slave labor? Um... You know... It's necessary for the growth and development of my, um... New kingdom. And I will do reparations. Just kidding, we hate colonialism. All about school? I feel fine. I do feel like if I were physically able to work, I'd be more excited. But now I'm just kind of like... I feel like I'm going to be in limbo for a while. But I am glad to have, like, less responsibility, kind of. The school was stressing me out. I'm also just happy I didn't flunk out. <laughs> because I got very close. But I haven't flunked a, a class in like two years. Because the last class I had to retake was back in 21.
<laughs> okay. Royal Advisor. Madame, the city's population is growing steadily. Our records of citizenship indicate that 250 people now call the city home. With a bigger city, we'll need to maintain even higher happiness in order to keep the people satisfied. Make sure you pay attention to the citizens and their issues to raise our happiness. Anyway, we still have lots of work to do. Let's make this city even bigger. By the way, remember earlier when I mentioned the Council of Crowns? I've heard a rumor that one of their members has been searching the land for a new ruler to join them. Perhaps they are aware of our progress. Having to balance school and stream must have been hard. Yeah, it's kind of like... Because stream is very much like having fun. And I just want to like have fun all the time. Like... I'm trying to think. Yes, there's been days where I chose to stream over doing homework, but I still made sure to get all my work done. I definitely think having like a physical, traditional job, I would have definitely failed out of school. Because the reason why I was failing classes in 2020 and then early 21 was because I was working too many hours. And I think it's totally different whenever you do physical versus online school. Because with online school, you can just close your laptop. You can log off. But when you have to physically go to school, you have to wake up, you gotta get there, you gotta get home. And you have to like sit physically in a lecture. It's a lot harder to, I guess, get out of it. Like looking back, I wish I would have done like a traditional school. But being able to work while doing classes was mandatory just so I could have money, right? But that's all gone now. And that's fine. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Why not? I love magic. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, a spell of great fortune. Dude, this wizard guy must like me or something. He keeps on, going, he keeps on giving me money. <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> I didn't expect to see this guy here. <coughs> Winston. Hey, uh, it's slime day. Got a present for me? Yeah, bud. Here, take some coins. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought he ate people! Oh my god. Yeah, you're so... Nice. Now, get out of my sight. I hate slime. Whenever I see the videos on my TikTok feed, I swipe away. Boots. Looks like he just wants somebody to pet his petty. To pat his belly. <laughs> Why not? I love cats. Mm -hmm. He's so happy. Royal Advisor. Some refugees have arrived in town. Shall we welcome them? Yeah, I love refugees. Mm -hmm. Very good. Damn, plus 15. Not bad. Okay, day 10 complete. Population plus 15, happiness plus 6, wealth plus 295. The people are happy and the city is growing. I haven't lost people or happiness in ages. And that's great. Um, guys, type 1 if you would move to my kingdom. Grandma. Hey, I was considering opening up a soup shop. I think it's a good idea. I'd need some gold. Why not? You just better give that business loan back. Mm -hmm. Very well. I'll sell my soup in the town square. 50 gold? That's nothing. That's nothing. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Hi, yawns. Chicken. It's running wild. Should we try to capture it? It's just a chicken. What what worse can it do? I think it's fine. It's fine. Let it roam free. Mm -hmm. 
Whoa, this thing is dangerous. Did it kill somebody? I think the chicken just committed murder. Georgie. You interested in making a deal, bub? Your people's souls in exchange for my gold? How about it? No, I would never mm -hmm. sacrifice my... Loyal... Followers? Hey, I'll get you next time, buddy. No. Louis. It seems your court is without much cake. I can provide cake. I'm a cake chef. May I join you? Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. Thank you. I'm grateful. I'm cakeful. I will make you cakes. See you later. I thought it was gonna charge me big bucks. Okay, you ever see like the videos of like small bakery owners talking about people complaining about the prices of their cakes? I think paying like, my birthday cake I bought this year, it was, I think, like, five layers. It was, like, 70 bucks, but I had a $5 coupon. So, it probably took them, like, two hours to make it. Granted, that's... That's, like, $35 an hour, but still. It probably took more than two hours, like, craftsmanship-wise to make it. So, like, to me, it's totally different if it's, like, from, like, a Walmart bakery. Because they make, like, tens to hundreds of cakes every week. But if you're ordering, like, a specialized cake, I think it's totally valid for bakeries to charge more. If you're getting, like, custom or, like, specialty designs or very cool piping or specific color mixings. I think it's totally... Okay, type one if you hear me. Type one if you hear me. Um, type your favorite number if you hear me. <laughs> Holding! <laughs> Dude, that's weird. Why is it doing this shit? But at least, because the issue it said OBS disconnected. So it's not Twitch. It's not Twitch. Okay, we're back, everybody. We're back. We're back. Because before, whenever OBS would, like, crash, or not crash, it just DC'd, it would, like, end the stream. But now, it keeps in the same VOD, which is so important. We're back, we're back, everybody, we're back. Thank you guys for answering. Anyway, so I think it's totally fine and valid for bakeries to charge a premium for specialty, de specialty designed cakes or treats. I think it's totally valid. And it's kind of like... If you are complaining about high, like, premium wares, if you're not gonna buy it, shut the fuck up. Like, don't try to, like, diminish the efforts that a craftsmanship per- or that, like, a crafty person makes. Like, whether it be art or baking or decorating, like, interior design, too. Like, you can get some pretty decent custom cakes from, like, Walmart and shit. If you can't afford, like, an independent bakery, and that's totally fine. Or even better yet, learn how to decorate yourself, bitch. <laughs> and then you can charge $100 for a shitty-ass cake. Anyway, back to it. <laughs> Royal Advisor. A petition to bring the circus to town is circulating. Could attract tourists. Are you interested? Yeah, I love the circus. Mm -hmm. I love exploiting animals for labor and entertainment. Let the people have their circus, then. Lore update! The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring a nice bit of gold. Day 11 complete. Population plus 20, happiness plus 17, and wealth plus 60. Dude, I'm crushing! Peanut. He's got a shiny coin! Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, 
okay, 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 okay. Mason. I'd like to build a new granary. This could cut this this could help expand our population, but it'll cost a bit. Yeah, I'm sorry that I couldn't help you build your tavern, but now we're loaded, so you can have as much business loans as you like. Mm -hmm. Mason. You got this? This will help our city grow. Dude, how does a granary cost less than a tavern? Boots. Looks like he wants someone to pat his belly. Why not? Mm -hmm. Mulder. Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're gonna want to hire me. Yeah, you did me well last time, Mulder. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go investigate something. Your mom's house? <laughs> Royal advisor. Our granary stock has been infected. It'll cost us to replace it, but if we don't, people could get sick. Should we do it? Dude, I just gave the bozo money and he can't build the granary correctly? Jackass, I'll fix it. Mm -hmm. Yes, our people's health is worse the cost. <clears throat> Lore update. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. Ooh, finally in the red. Ew. Day 12 complete. Population plus 7, happiness plus 4, and wealth minus 135. Dude, I've been ruling for barely two weeks, and I'm absolutely crushing. The all-seeing eye. It seems... happy. Okay. Yet, yet. Mom says I need to ask your permission to go on an adventure, so can I please? Please? Yeah, you gave me money last mm -hmm. time. Just bring me, um, twofold this time. Yay! I'm so excited to go exploring. Uh oh. Dragon. Oh, give me your gold or I'll eat your townspeople. Now. Can't they just call the gods and tell them to dispose of this dragon? Get them out of my treasured hall. I do care about my people a lot. And if he takes all my gold, then so be it. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Haha, <laughs> yes, I'll take that. Minus 400, not bad. That's almost like a dollar per person. Pancake. It's that slightly magical cat from before. Does this mean we're friends now? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I guess we are. <laughs> Monsieur Moulton. Hello, madam. Are you looking for experienced barbers in your court? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then I shall join you. I'm the best of the best. Dude, his hair is whack. He is huffing so much copium. His hair looks disgusting. It looks like a cotton swab. Lore update. The circus has packed up and left town. But not without leaving behind even more gold coins. Day 13 complete. Population plus 1, happiness plus 5, and wealth minus 380. But I did save the whole town. Why are they not bringing that up? Uh oh. Alien. You haven't been talking to Skelly, have you? If I lie, it's going to be so hard to keep up the lie. And he doesn't look too scary, so I will be honest. Mm -hmm. Here, take this. I was never here, okay? Okay, I won't, I won't say anything. You're fine. <laughs> Madame Abil. 
I accidentally stayed up all night eating candies. Can I have some gold to go to the doctor? Oh, she has a sucker in her hand. First, you need to throw that away, and then you can go to the doctor. Here, uh, we love healthcare. We love public healthcare. Mm -hmm. I never thought I could eat too many sweets. Dude, $10 for a doctor's visit? That's crazy. Uh-oh. Yet, yet. I'm back! I found some friends on my adventure! Do you like making new friends? Good if he... Like, lets wolves in here or some type of monster? He's dead to me. Mm -hmm. New friends are the best! Okay, he just- he just kidnapped some people, is what he did. <gasps> Make it rain, holy! Night. I have returned from my quest. A great bounty of treasure is ours, my lady. Yep. Boots. Can I have some food? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I would never let a cat go hungry. Or any civilian, for the matter. Day 14. Population plus 5, happiness plus 6, and wealth plus 288. See, who knew being nice to everybody could pay off? Honestly. Who knew? And this is why I love communism. Sneaky girl. Want me to steal from the rich and give to you? Not just the rich, I'll steal from whoever, basically. Never. Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. Taking the high road, huh? I'll see you around. I will never steal. Mm -mm. Skelly. You've got a skeleton of your own, you know. Don't you find it weird that you can't see it? No, it's normal. I just know that it exists. Mm -mm. You don't think anything is weird, do you? I think he was trying to flirt. Okay. Madame Abil. I accidentally stayed up all night eating candies again. Can I have some gold to go to the doctor? Yes, I love public health care, but... Mm -hmm. Dumbass, learn your lesson. You did this literally yesterday. I never thought I could eat too many sweets. Isn't she part of my city council? Uh-oh. The all-seeing eye. It seems sad. Jester. Oh, -ho, might I borrow some gold for new juggling balls? Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. Oh, <laughs> very good. I think she's using the gold to buy more candies. Probably, but you know, it's just 10 bucks. That's like two subs. That's totally fine. My castle can allow it. I have $780. It's fine. It's nothing. It's a drop in the bucket. My watermelon's all gone. Day 15 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus three, and wealth minus 20. You know who else's luck is going to be very bad? The non-subs, because everybody, we are in our industry. So it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad previewing all month long, or... You can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Show your pride by subbing for free with Prime, everybody. <laughs> I love, dude. Well, if you were, you were, if you would have done that bait like ten seconds quicker, I could have used it. <laughs> that was good. That was good. Get some water. Get a snack. We'll see some of you guys in a few. Oh wait, I think I just. I think I know how to capture the audio. 
I think I know how to do it. Actually, no, I don't. <laughs> I lied. <laughs> Yeah, I don't. Peace and lied, people died. Dude, look at this. I have this huge zit right here. And it's right where my glasses land. And it hurts so much. It hurts so much. People, what? No, it's like... <laughs> it's, it's in my kingdom, obviously, not in real life. Don't worry. Don't worry. Oh, wait, 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 I think I might have gotten it. Hold, I'm, I'm trying to figure out how to capture the audio so it, it still captures. Why is it listing as... Oops! <laughs> okay. That didn't work. Okay, that- that didn't work. Let me try one more thing, one more thing. Okay, well, no. I don't- I- because I know how I fixed this before. Because I have all of my audio going through just my desktop audio track. So in order for me to change that, I have to change my- like sound settings on my computer before I can edit in OBS. So, it's fine. Doesn't fucking matter. Guys, I'm a pro streamer. Don't worry. Okay, I did run the ad. Everybody should be back from the ad by now. Don't worry. <clears throat> okay. Yet, yet. Mom says I need to ask your permission to go on an adventure, so can I? Please, please. Yes, bring back more gold. Mm -hmm. I don't want friends this time. I want gold. Mason, could I trouble you for a sandwich? Surely the cost of one sandwich is nothing to a great queen like you. Bozo. It'd be different if you wanted flour, so you can make your own bread, but you want that little pre-packaged sandwich you want from Safeway? That's so overpriced, $8 when you can make it at home for two? But I also say treat yourself, so yeah, I'll buy it for you. It's fine, I'm rich, I'm rich. Fantastic, I'm excited to eat this. I regret this. If he asks for a sandwich again tomorrow, I'm banishing him. Peanut, he's got a shiny coin. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Royal Advisor. Since we opened our borders, trade from our caravans have increased dramatically. Do you wish to tax the merchants? Yeah. Tax the money makers. I'm a collected fee from the traders. Mm 
Mason. Working conditions for us are unsafe. Will you please spend some gold on improving our ability to work? I am a socialist. And I am pro-union. But... This is going to cost me money. And I technically am an Amazon employee. So... Last time I gave you money, you built a granary. And it, everything became moldy because you chose to build it incorrectly. This is your last business loan. Mm -hmm. Thanks, the builders will appreciate this. Day 16 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus five, and wealth plus 62. Petite Soris. There's a mouse. Should we chase it away? No, he's our friend. It seems happy. <laughs> Little Fang. I'm the Duke of Spook. Do you want a spooky nickname? Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. Make it my rapper name. Hmm. You can be the Creep Queen. You told me that last time, bud. Hi, Kimari. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Welcome in, hon. Miriam. Hello again, queenly person. <laughs> Albert asked me to come here and tell a story with you. A yellow bird meets a green bird in the sky. Does the yellow bird soar higher than the green? Huh? Yes. The yellow bird wheels through the sky. She shimmers in the sunlight. Oh, <laughs> how lovely. High up in the sky, the yellow bird meets a blue bird. Does the yellow bird stop to sing with it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, <laughs> the sweet musical tones of the two new friends fill the air. The singing attracts a flock of nearby birds of all shapes and colors. The sky is filled with song. <laughs> what a lovely ending to the story, don't you think? Albert liked it. I will come to visit you again sometime, queenly person. It's fun to tell stories with you. Dude, I think she's just crazy. Skelly. Any mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fee if you're interested. You know the drill. You don't even gotta ask, Skelly. Just take my money. I'll uncover the truth and report back to you. Sneaky girl. The guards confiscated some gold that I, um, found. Can I have it back? No, you're a crook. You're a robber and a stealer. You're keeping it, huh? But I stopped, I mean, I found it. No, you, you copped it. I don't like criminals. Day 17 complete. Population plus three, happiness plus two, and wealth plus 45. Guys, I want to get to a million followers in game stream ends when i get to a million <laughs> what do you call the people who work under you it's not peasants what is it called peace i too hmm. i also think it's funny how i just have the money sprawled out by my throne i'm surprised nobody's stolen it blacksmith I'm a blacksmith, and I'd like to set up shop here. I can pay my own way. I just need your permission. What do you say? Yes, we can use you for the armory. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'll show you my incredible skill. Just you wait. Oh. Madame, I've heard about the dragon attack you were made to endure. I've come up with an idea to strike back. I can craft a blade powerful enough to slay the dragon to take all his treasures. It won't be easy, though. I need to track down the finest metals and they're quite costly. Might have a few hundred gold to begin my search. Yes. Fuck that dragon. Mm -hmm. He threatened my whole- 
It's worth it. It's fine. Three hundred dollars is nothing. It's a drop in the bucket. It's fine for all all my civilians. Thank you, madam. I will keep you posted about further developments. I won't let you down. We'll strike back at that dragon yet. Royal advisor. Some refugees have arrived in town. Should we welcome them? Yes, we love refugees. Mm -hmm. Very good. There doesn't seem to be a punishment for when the population increases, which is very good. Mulder. I couldn't uncover anything. I was being followed. Too risky. Did you see anyone follow me out of the castle? No? Mm -mm. I suspected as much. Very suspicious. It's probably Skelly, but he's also on my side too. LD34. I've been working on a video game. It's this new thing I came up with. Think it will catch on? Yeah. I love video games. Smile. Mm -hmm. Me too. I am excited about the possibilities. Anyway, it's a game you play with others and go around killing monsters. You get a sword. That's that's like an RPG, but that's also like real life in this time period. Mm -hmm. That's like <laughs> that's like how people make like farming sims. Or grocery store worker sim. <laughs> yeah, swords are great, right? So, when you slay a monster, you get experience points and... Hey, are you still listening? Yeah, yeah, I'm... Yeah, I'm good. Good. Well, thanks for listening to my idea. I'm a kind, benevolent leader. I would never ignore a constituent. Day 18 complete. Population plus 18, happiness plus 14, and wealth minus 250. The Royal Advisor. I've got new good news for you, madam. The city's population has reached 500. The townspeople are celebrating there's be a huge festival in the square. Our growing population will demand even more happiness now, so be sure to keep our approval high. She even made me a little trophy. Can we smelt it down for the gold? Anyway, I just wanted to give you my congratulations. Let's keep working hard, okay? Of course. Mm -hmm. My loyal advisor. I just wonder how big this city will grow under your rule, madam. Do you doubt me? How dare you doubt my potential? You too. I would like some money, please. Why, though? This, this is like he's robbing me. He don't even tell me why he needs the money. I don't want to be too much of a pushover. Because literally, everybody else has told me why they need the money. But this guy, he's not saying anything. But also, he looks kind of big and scary. If I don't give him money, I feel like he's going to go on a rampage. Because if you get robbed, just give him your shit. Most everything is replaceable for the most part. Hmm. I'll give it to him. Mm -hmm. oh. Thank you for the money, good madam. This is good money. Yeah, you copped a hundred from me, man. No, I would not like some soup. It's way too hot here. I'm also upset. I, lo I got robbed. I got robbed. Scientist. Hello, hello. I am well. I am a scientist. I do science for you, my queen. You see, the city has grown. And we have grown too. The science community, that is. We now have our own council of science, of which I am the leader. Today, I simply wish to introduce myself. And now I have. I have. I will visit you again in the future regarding our project. Science projects. He's kind of weird, isn't he? Oh no, politics, politics! Oh no. Royal advisor. An angry pineapple trader has denounced your rule. Shall we have her arrested? No. 
Why would we arrest somebody for not liking the rules we have here? They're not breaking the rules. No, I'm not going to arrest them. Mm -mm. She'll be rallying support against you in the meantime. I'm sure. That's, that's fine. She just can't be trading pineapples under the table. The Sultan. I've got a business proposition for you in your tiny little town. Are you interested? Yes, sir. Aha. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I'll bring you details soon. Dude, this is like cryptos. This is like crypto coins. Invest now. Never make money. Okay, the festival in the town square celebrating the town's 500 citizen is still going strong. Bringing happiness to all those who attend. D19 complete. Population plus zero happiness plus three and wealth plus 50. Let's go. Guys, I want to get to a million followers. Mufang. I'm the Duke of Spook. Do you want a spooky nickname? Yes, that sounds great. Mm -hmm. How about the Creep Queen? Oh my god, how did I know? <laughs> he comes here like every other day just to- I think he's flirting. Skelly. Do you find me humorous? Yeah, that, that was pretty good, Skelly. That was pretty good. Haha, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, it's a good one, right? I do think Skelly is trying to riz me up. Little Timmy. I'm Little Timmy. Nice to meet ya. You like ice cream? I actually love ice cream. It is my favorite. Mm-hmm. Mwah! Ew! Me too! Why did he kiss me? Ew! Get away from me, child. Grandma. Hey, hello, sweetie. Can I borrow a coin for the newspaper? I gave you a business loan. Is your business failing? But a single coin? Yes. I'll toss it on the ground for you to pick up. And I hope you break your back when you bend mm -hmm. over. Thank you, dearie. This bitch. Madame Abiel. I accidentally stayed up all night eating candies. Can I have some gold to go to the doctor? You a dumbass. Mm -hmm. I never thought I could eat too many sweets. This is literally the third time you've done this. She's actually D.U.M. The festival in the town square is winding down and people are getting back to their normal lives. Oh, that feels so much better. Oh my god. Wait, honestly, does the crown look fine? Okay, because before I had it stretched out like this. Because this looks better, right? But this, oh my god, this doesn't like grip on my head. Yo, dude, this looks so bad. <laughs> it's like just on top of my head. Like this, this makes it look like a headband. That's fine. I'm being comfy. I'm being comfy. Day 20 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus eight, and wealth minus 11. Uh-oh. Sneaky girl. Want me to steal from the rich and give to you? Not just the rich, I'll steal from whoever, basically. Dude, you literally got caught two days ago. No, I would not condone stealing. Mm -mm. Taking the high road, huh? I'll see you around. Dude, she just never learns her lesson, does she? The Sultan. An offer for you, friend. I would purchase a shipment of luxury goods for you for a fair price. Sure, why not? Let me flaunt my wealth. I already have a castle. I might as well fill it with nice things. Oh wait, what? He gave me money? What? Quite agreeable. We shall work together again, I hope. What? 
Oh wait, did I like sell my things? I'm confused. Winston. Hey, uh, you think you can tell people to stop calling me slime ball? It hurts my feelings. Yeah, bullying is bad, and we'll expel anybody who bullies. Mm -hmm. Thanks, boss. Witch. Oh, it's been like a week since we've seen her. There's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slam for a few gold coins if you want. Yeah, you did great last time. I'll show those creeps. Skelly. Reporting in? I solved the mystery about who stole Miss Pumpkin's baking pan. Want me to turn him in? Yes, lock him up. <laughs> oh, it's off to the dungeon for him. The witch has slain a goblin with a bounty on his head. We've earned a portion of the reward as tax income. Gossip is spreading about a heroic purple witch slaying goblins in the lower quarter. She's become something of a folk hero. Day 21 complete. Population minus one, happiness plus two, and wealth plus three, 15. Wait, people are moving in every day. I just realized at the end. Night. My lady. I wish to embark upon a treacherous quest. Yeah, just bring back um, maidens or gold. For the kingdom, I shall return to you, my lady. Pancake. It's that slightly magical crap from before. Does this mean we're friends now? Obvi, mm -hmm. we're besties. I guess we are. Military General. One of our prisoners has escaped. May I have some gold to offer a reward for her recapture? Is it the girl who steals? But what if they were a good prisoner? My guardsmen know best. I will trust them. Someone's bound to find her soon with a sweet reward. You best not have pocketed it. Witch. My broom's all worn out, and it's my birthday. Think you could buy me a new broom for a present? Sure would be nice of you. Yeah, why not? I'll just write it off on my tax return. It's a business expense. Thank you so much. You're the best. Royal advisor. Some refugees have arrived in town. Should we welcome them? Yes, I love refugees. Very good. Population plus 15, happiness plus 10, and wealth minus 100. Okay, my goal is to get to a population 1,000. I think that is reasonable. My goal is 1,000. And we'll just draw in the extra zeros to get to that fat Millie. Yarno. Hello, hello. I'm Yarno of the Comfy Kingdom. You may not believe this, but I'm the royal assistant of King Pin himself. Indeed, the very same. I've been doodling around this kingdom of yours and- Oh, wait. What's that over there? Okay. <laughs> Button boy. Good madam. Did you happen to see a blue fella come through here just now? Strange noodly limbs made of yarn. Yeah, I would never lie. Mm -hmm. I knew he was around here somewhere. I'm going to find that darn yarno. He's been running around claiming to be the kingpin's royal system, which of course he is not. In fact, it is I, Button Boy, who represents the comfy kingdom in the esteemed Council of Crowns. Have you heard of the Council of Crowns, good madam? Yes, I'm trying to become a part of it myself. Mm -hmm. Just like the UN. Then surely you've thought about joining. Perhaps we could work out a bit of a deal. The honor has been giving me nothing but trouble. If you could somehow put a stop to his shenanigans, I might be able to get a meeting with Pia, the advisor of the Celestial Kingdom. If anyone would be able to induct your kingdom into the council, it would be her. What do you say? 
Will you help me catch that darned yarn? Why not? Mm -hmm. Either way, if they're both lying, then I can lock them both up. Very good. I'll leave the details up to your discretion. Once Yarno is out of the way, I'll set up a meeting with Pia. Thank you for your assistance in this matter, good madam. I'm sure we will meet again soon. It's kind of like Hitman to where, like, if you play the role, I feel like most normal people will just believe you are who you say you are. Like, if you walk into a shop with a big business suit and say that you're an executive and ask for, like, the manager, they'll believe you. Chester, I'm hungry. Can I eat some, folks? I've got plenty of gold so I can pay you back for their lives. No. Mm -mm. Uh, fine. I'll leave him alone. Monsieur Monton, demand for my services is through the roof. May I have your permission to raise my prices? Why are you raising the price? Since business is booming, that is not inflation, that is the free market choosing to raise its prices just like the egg companies did last year. <gasps> that is called price gouging, which is illegal. Mm -hmm. We could be making so much more gold though. We hate capitalism. Lil Fang. You feeling spooky today? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Heck yeah, let the blood flow. Why is he killing people whenever I'm feeling spooky? That's not fair. <gasps> Thank you, kind sir. Knight. I have returned from my quest. A great bounty of treasure is ours, milady. I love how he just gives me the money he finds. I love that for us. Day 23 complete. Population minus one. Happiness plus zero. And wealth plus 250. Which? There's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slay them for a few gold coins if you want. Mm -hmm. I will always say yes to you. I'll show those creeps. Royal Advisor. A petition to bring the circus to town is circulating. Could attract tourists. Are you interested? Yes, the circus was great last time. We loved all the elephants that died due to exhaustion. Let the people have their circus, then. Peanut. He's got a shiny coin. Thank you, Peanut. Oh, he gave me five that time. He usually gives me one. Mason. I wish to construct a tavern, but I'll need some gold for me to make it happen. I'm talking a considerable amount of gold, like a couple hundred at least? What do you think? Sure. It's been two weeks. The town is booming. I will gladly give you a business loan that has a 50% interest rate to build a tavern. Mm -hmm. The townsfolk will be happy to have a place to drink. Wizard, have you seen my magical cat pancake? Yes, I have. Mm -hmm. Oh, very good. I knew he was around here somewhere. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. The witch has slain a goblin with a bounty on its head. We earned a portion of the reward at ta as taxed income. Day 24 complete. Population plus 10, happiness plus 23, and wealth minus 70. Dude, I'm getting so close to that 1k. You know what else I'm close to getting? <laughs> I don't know. Everybody, if you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Because we are another 30 minutes in the stream. Can we hit our daily goal? Any new follows today? Smile. Blacksmith. Madame. About the dragon blade. Yes, that's what I'm calling the sword now. 
I've purchased some top quality metals, but I'll need workers to help me do the crafting. Can you spare a few men? Yes. Anything to slay that darn dragon. Mm -hmm. This will help speed things up. I shall return to you with a magnificent blade, madam. Hi, Pride. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Royal advisor. Some refugees have arrived in town. Should we welcome them? Yes, I love mm -hmm. refugees. Very good. Chester. I'm hungry. Can I eat some folks? I've got plenty of gold so I can pay you back for their lives. No. You can <clears throat> never have any of my beloved followers. Never. Ah, fine. I'll leave them alone. I'm not saying that pride, but this game is pretty cute. I remember play watching Markiplier play this years ago. And I like it because it's like... Like, Flash game-esque. And it's really cute. Petit Saurus. It's the same mask from before. Is he offering me something? Yes, I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it! Oh! He found a coin! He's not gonna bestow his wisdom on me. He looks very smart. Military General. The escaped prisoner has been recaptured thanks to the bounty you offered. Our citizens can rest easier knowing that she's been put away again. Yes. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. Day 25 complete. Population plus 10, happiness plus 9, and wealth plus 15. Dang, I- the- my daily population, it used to be 25, but now I'm going up like 40 people a day. We are getting so many new immigrants. We love that. Boots. Is this cat trying to tell me something? It seems like it wants to help. Yarno? Is he talking about Yarno? Maybe this cat can help find Yarno. That must be it. I need to provide plenty of tuna, of course, but surely it would be worth the cost. Well, should I hire this cat to find Yarno? Yes! Mm -hmm. Me and the homies hate Yarno. A hundred dollars? Bro, that's like five sa famine salmon flays. <laughs> famine salmon. All I do is jamming. I hope he understands what I want. Oh well, nothing to do now but wait. Witch. There's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slam for a few good coins if you want. Yes, sir? Mm -hmm. I'll show those creeps. Royal Advisor. Fires have been breaking out frequently on Cabbage Street. Show me a solo well to make water more accessible there. Yes. Mm -hmm. Why are fires breaking out? I will instruct the mason to proceed with construction. Little Fang. You feeling spooky today? No. Because mm -mm. every time you say I feel spooky, you kill somebody. Not even a little spook, little baby bat. Yeah, fuck off. Peanut. He's got a shiny coin. Mm -hmm. The circus has packed up and left town, but not without leaving behind even more gold coins. Gossip is spreading about a heroic purple witch slaying goblins in the lower quarter. She's become something of a folk hero. Also, since I told her, or since she told me about like the spirits and then I gave her money, she stopped asking about it. Because I thought it would be like a, a daily donation to the spirits, but she hasn't asked for any money since. All the witch has been doing is slaying goblins. Which is very good. Day 26 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus 14, and wealth minus 235. Getting so close to 1k! Which? There's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slam for a few good coins if you want. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir? 
I'll show those creeps. Royal Advisor. The prison is in need of repairs. Might there be a room in the budget to devote a few hundred gold to it? Yeah, so we're gonna give the prisoners lovely cells with televisions. Mm -hmm. Very good. It is best not to allow the prison to crumble. I'm sure you agree. Also, if it wears and tears too much, then they can just like dig their way out with spoons. We can't be having that. Wizard. I'm just passing through and I thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Why not? Oh, interesting. Seems like it went well for you. I don't think there's ever been a time where he's given me a bad spell. Boots. Can I have some food? Yes. Mm -hmm. I would never let a cat go hungry in my kingdom. Royal advisor. Some refugees have arrived in town. Should we welcome them? Yes. Mm -hmm. Very good. Gossip is spreading about a heroic purple witch slaying goblins in the lower quarter. She's become something of a folk hero. Damn, plus 50 people? Holy. Day 27 complete. Population plus 35, happiness plus 18, and wealth minus 162. Hmm. It's almost like as the city grows, everything costs more. I only have $600. Butler. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, milady. Might I have the rest of the day off? Yes. You can take a little vacation. Mm -hmm. Oh, I said no! Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, no. I didn't mean to. Oh dear. I told my friends I'd be there. That was a mistake. I swear. Yet, yet. I'm back. I found these shiny yellow stones. Pretty cool, right? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. So cool. Dude, who's this guy? Bum 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 bum. Yeah, you like my rhythm, bruh. Yeah, but get a shirt on, man. Mm -hmm. Have some decency in my presence. I am the queen. Yeah, I'm in the groove. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a spell of good fortune. He's never given me a bad spell. And I fear that one time I say no, I'm gonna get something really bad. My lady, our city has grown so much that visitors are becoming lost quite easily. Should we devote more gold to the hiring of tour guides? Yes, we love mm -hmm. tourism. The tourists will thank you, I'm sure. <gasps> 948 people, I'm so close to 1k. Day 28 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus eight, and wealth plus 190. Boots. Looks like he wants someone to pat his belly. Easy. Easiest yes of my whole life. Jester. Oh, I wish to put on a show. May I have some funds to do so? Yeah, you can take out a business loan. 50% interest rate, of course. Oh, 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 very good. You better be good. Ooh, Stumpy. Hello, Queen. I am a tree of the Western Forest. As you can see, however, I have been, shall we say, shortened. This is due largely, in fact, to the actions of your team of woodcutters. My home has been chopped clean through. In your reckless pursuit of expansionism, you have now disrupted the lives of myself and my good tree folk brothers and sisters. I demand compensation by way of golden coin, so that we might repair this, how shall I put it, diplomatic rift between us. A paltry sum of, say, 1,000 coins would go a long way towards relaxing our troubled relationship. I do believe in reparations. 
But I don't have a thousand dollars. And I feel if I say no, he's gonna come and bring all his little tree friends and just kill us all. I'll do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm in debt! Oh no! Oh, my money is gone! Look, it's just pee pee poofing, it's gone. The fourth pass, the first step on the path to recovery has been taken. Well, this does not go unnoticed, be sure that I am not finished. Dude, you wanted 1k, you got 1k, and I'm gonna complain more. I'll be speaking with your mason immediately regarding the matters of sustainable woodland harvesting. You've done the right thing here today. My good tree folk will respect that despite your woodcutter's aggression. With this, I bid you a good day. May your roots grow deep and strong. Uh oh. Hi, Crystal. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Night, my lady. I've come across a chest of gold in my adventures. Will you please accept this gift? Yes, yes, yes. Please, please, please. Mm -hmm. It is my pleasure to serve you. Thank you, kind knight. Royal advisor. The treasury is empty, my lady. We could raise taxes a bit further, but the people won't like it too much. Should we try? Taxing the public is necessary for government reform and infrastructure. Now that the country is in debt, we must tax the rich! Mm -hmm. Higher taxes mean more gold to spend. They didn't get much sadder. Look, only minus four happiness for $200? That's nothing. Population minus four, happiness minus four, wealth minus 750. But look, 994 people, so close to 1k. Little Fang. You feeling spooky today? No. Mm -mm. Not even a tiny spook, little baby bat. You love being brokies? Me too. I, I love being a brokie. <laughs> Skelly. Any mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fee if you're interested. You know I can't say no to you, Skelly. Mm -hmm. I'll uncover the truth and report back to you. Wizard, I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Yes, sir? Oh, interesting. Seems like it went well for you. Big news. Our population has reached 1,000. Be sure to mind our happiness rating. The citizens expect the best from us. Yes. Drummer. Boom, boom, ba -dum, boom, boom. I'm really getting into it. Are you? The drumming, but not you, sir. Get a shirt on. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought, but I'm so into it. The jester's show was loved by the court and put everybody into a happy mood. Day 30 complete. Population plus 20, happiness plus 18, wealth plus 290. A whole month in my new kingdom. And I hit a thousand population. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, Chatter, should we keep playing? Because this game is endless. But I kind of, I kind of want to see what happens with the yarn people, because I feel like it's gonna be like more political then. Because it's kind of like espionage. As long as you want. <laughs> okay, we'll keep going for a little bit. I think I'll, I'll just see what happens with the yarn people. I also want to see if like the town will cover the whole background of the sky. Monsieur Montun. It is nice to see you, madame. Do you like my new haircut? It looks exactly the same, but I'm gonna say it looks great! Mm -hmm. 
Ah, uh, yes, thank you. Thank you. If you want, you can start spicing things up. Oh, no. Should I? Yeah, I guess. I was gonna say that when I want to end, I want to do, like, all the bad answers. <laughs> how about at, at the two-hour mark? I want to see, like, how far I can get within two hours. And then we'll just go downhill, baby. To the ground. Grandma. I read the nicest story in the paper today. Isn't it a lovely day? Yes, it is. It is quite nice mm -hmm. out. Very good, dearie. Jester. My show seems to have gone over well. I wish to expand my production. Funds, I shall need 400 gold or so. You better make that back tenfold. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this show will be a delight and a stone. <laughs> <laughs> the flop era. <laughs> Little Fang, you feeling spooky today? No. Mm -mm. Not even a tiny spook? Little baby bat? If I could ban the vampire, I would. Butler. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, milady. Might I have the rest of the day off? Yes, I didn't mean to let you work the other day. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. Thank you. We will toast to your honor. The jester dazzled the court with a display of acrobatics and theater, raising the spirits of all in attendance. Day 31 complete. Happiness plus 23 wealth minus 400. The Sultan. I've got a business proposition for you in your tiny little town. Are you interested? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Ah, I'll bring you details soon. Witch, there's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slay them for a few gold coins if you want. Yes, sir? Mm -hmm. Do your thing. I'll show those creeps. Also, ain't it funny how me as the queen just sitting on my fat ass all day on the throne doing nothing? I haven't even, like, fought in a battle. Royal Advisor. Since we opened our borders, travelers from all around are joining our city. Doesn't it just warm your heart? Yes, I love mm. immigrants. The posture is horrible. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like... I, I have permanent gamer stance, but I don't have the laptop. <laughs> it's, it's the weight of the responsibility on my shoulders bringing me down. It's lovely to have so many new friends. The Sultan. How about this? Give me 200 gold, and I'll provide a large shipment of luxury goods. I don't- I don't have that. I have 22 bucks, sir. Mm -mm. Very well. Perhaps another day we can arrange something. Oh no! Mason. As the city grows, we require more gold to continue expanding our infrastructure. An increase of our construction budget, say by 500 gold, will allow us to build a great number of recreational facilities. Why am I so broke? The, the trees came in! They wanted reparations! Okay, from my understanding, if I go in debt, then at the end of the day, I just tax my people. And as long as I don't tax them every day, I think it's fine. So let's go in a little bit of debt for mm -hmm. infrastructure. We're gonna hit our debt ceiling. Ours will be a city, city rivaled by none at this rate. Gossip is spreading about a heroic purple witch slaying goblins in the lower quarter. She's become something of a folk hero. A little bit of debt, sis. That's a lot. Dude, I have $20,000 or $25,000 in student debt. I don't give a fuck. $400 is nothing. It's nothing. Wait till you get those go to college. Then you know how I feel. Okay, day 32 complete. Population plus 4, happiness plus 21, wealth minus 505. Wait, there was no option to tax. Oh no. Uh oh. Chester. 
In need of cash, huh? I see you're in debt. I could hook you up if you could let me eat a few folks. How about it? No. Mm -mm. I guess you'll find some other way out of this mess, huh? No, look at you. You guys want to eat each other? Stop it. Night. My lady, I've come across a chest of gold in my adventures. Will you please accept this gift? Yes, sir? Mm -hmm. It is my pleasure to serve you. See, I don't need to kill people. I get a hundred bucks. I have other people do the work for me. Royal advisor. My lady, we're in dire need of funds. We'll have to drastically increase taxes in order to stay afloat. Mason. Should we sell off some of our construction supplies to get us out of debt? No, you need that. You, need, you can't do that. You can't sell that. That's what I hope you'd say, but we still need money somehow. They increased taxes without your consent? Yeah, they did. She didn't even ask me. Knight. My lady, I've come across a chest of gold in my adventures. Will you please accept this gift? Yes, yes, yes. Please, please, please. Mm -hmm. Yes, out of debt, baby. Saved. Any chatters want to help me get out of debt in real life by gifting a million subs right now? Who wants to go on a crusade for their queen? <laughs> it is my pleasure to serve you. Okay, day 32 complete. Population plus zero. Happiness minus 20. Health plus 500. Royal advisor. Our granary stock has been infected. It'll cost us to replace it, but if we don't, people could get sick. Should we do it? I guess we're going back in debt. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Yes, our people's health is worth the cost. Witch. Looking for a coin. I could cast some dark magic to summon some gold, but it might cost a soul or two. No! Mm -mm. Let me know if you change your mind. Just a couple of souls. Aren't you the town hero? Stop. You're supposed to kill goblins, not the people. Royal advisor. Without any gold, we're a bit stuck. We could sell off some of our goods, but that might make people sad. Should we do it? Yes. If I have to sell my golden throne, my crown, my golden threaded sheets, that is fine for my people. Mm -hmm. We aren't in that much debt. Everybody chill. I know, it's like 10 books and everybody's freaking out. Dude, how much debt is an American? Like, a billion, trillion, million? Royal advisor. Having gold is more important, you're right. Ooh, the scientist. The Council of Science has had most wonderful idea. Yes, yes. They advised a way to broadcast music across the whole entire city using a network of sonic hardwire. I'm not sure if this would be useful, but wouldn't it be fun to try? In the name of science. I'm certain we could do it on our budget as well. A mere hundred gold to device. Yes. Mm -hmm. We'll get it started on it straight away. Soon the streets will be filled with song. At least he's doing something wholesome. The Sultan. I've got a business proposition for you in your tiny little town. Are you interested? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Alas, I'll bring you details soon. Just tell me now. Day 34 complete. Population plus zero. Happiness minus 14. Wealth plus 80. LD 3.4. I'm going to leave the kingdom now to pursue my dream of becoming a game dev. Goodbye. Mm -hmm. 
Maybe our paths will cross again one day. Probably not, though. Take this cog to remember me by. I've got plenty. So you can have this one. Oh, is, is that just gonna stay here now? <laughs> okay. New collectible, everybody. Butler. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, milady. Might I have the rest of the day off? Yes, this is the third time you've done this in two weeks, though. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I will toast to your honor. Guys, stop smashing or passing everybody. Guys, come on. I am the queen. I cannot be smashing and passing my followers. Sneaky girl. <laughs> Want me to steal from the rich and give to you? Not just the rich, I'll steal from... Whoever, basically. No, I will not stoop to your level. Mm -mm. Taking the hard road, huh? I'll see you around. Monsieur Espirit. Good day, madam. Do you require any haunting services? For a small price, I'll scare some people for you. Yes, yes, do a little bit of pranks. I love YouTube prank videos. Why do you want to scare people away? Oh well, I'll do it. I thought he was just doing a little bit of trolling. He killed somebody. Uh oh. The witch. The spirits are appeased right now, but perhaps we should grant them an offering of gold. I know the spirit world always appreciates gold, and it might prevent them from haunting us in the future. What do you say? 200 gold and make a decent offering. Why does she only ask for offerings when I'm broke? She only asked me at this at the very beginning. I'm gonna say no. No. I'll have 200. Mm -mm. Nothing for now, then. I'll let you know if anything changes with the spirit world. Day 35 complete. Population minus 2, happiness plus 3, and wealth minus 5. Hmm. Now. I'm curious. What would happen? If we let everything go to ruin. If I chose theoretically the worst outcome. You guys can find out what happens after the ad. Because everybody, we are another hour in the stream. So it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99. Just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe. See if you have a Prime sub available. Um, show your pride by subbing for free with Prime. Zero to ten, that felt capitalist. I work for Amazon. <laughs> okay, after the ad, we're gonna deal with the anti art. I'm gonna be a, I'm gonna be a, um, a comic. <laughs> so if you don't want to miss a single second, subscribe, everybody. I want to see what I... Because not that this game is boring, but it's it's endless. There's no, like, end game. So I, I just want to see what... I want to get the bad ending. Okay, I'm doing all negative answers now. Oh, no. Wait. I did say I want to find out what happened with the yarn dude. Boots. It's my bounty hunter cat. I'd almost given up on him. Did you get him? Did you find Yarno? Ah, you got me! That cat just wouldn't leave me alone until he came back here. Was it Button Boy who sent the cat? He's been trying to steal my position as advisor for years. He claims to be the true advisor, but it's just a lie. He's only a button after all. Ah, Yarno the Blue, and the true advisor to the Comfy Kingdom. Except no substitute. Whoops. Gotta run! It's gonna be Button. <gasps> button Boy. Gods! Seize that yawn! Well done, madam. I'm not sure how much a part you actually played in this, but Yano's been found. I'm in a generous mood, so I'll set up a meeting with Advisor Pia in the Celestial Kingdom. She's quite busy, but you should expect her to come by sometime soon. Make sure this castle is nicely cleaned. You'll want to impress her. Oh, 
Okay, so since we actually got the Yarno cutscene now, I lied. I'm gonna be a goody good until Pia comes by. And then we're gonna run this kingdom to the ground! Skelly. Reporting in, I managed to catch the necromancer behind a recent string of possessions. She's behind bars now. At least, until she learns her lesson. Royal Advisor. The people are demanding that a notorious criminal be exiled from the city. His crimes include theft, arson, and forgery. What do you say? Shall we exile him? Okay. These crimes aren't that bad, minus the arson. Forgery? Everybody in Minecraft signs their field trip forms when they forgot to give it to their moms in the morning, okay? Theft? He probably just stole a loaf of bread, but arson? That is kind of bad. He's kind of bad, so... But exile? He's gonna die. We'll just send him to Mar-a-Lago. <laughs> I'll have the guards do so at once. Little Fang. Hello, friend. You had to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah. What's in it? I see. Fame and fortune for you. I'm proud to say I've never forged a Minecraft. Yeah, me neither. I only did it one time. It was when I was like in third grade. Because my mom's signature is literally just this. It's literally just a single... A, like a simple swoosh. I did it in third grade. I'm, I'm reformed. I don't do it. Also, when you're an adult, you can, you can sign your own papers. It's cool. Wizard. I'm just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a spell of great fortune. Day 36 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus 10, and wealth plus 200. Boots. Looks like he wants somebody to pat his belly. Mm -hmm. Why not? Monsieur Spirit. Hmm. You call this a castle? Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Indeed it is. <laughs> Trick question. You did that joke the first time we met and it was weird. Mulder. Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're gonna want to hire me. Mm -hmm. Give me something good this time, Mulder. I'm gonna go investigate something. Chester, I'm hungry. Can I eat some, folks? I got plenty of gold, so I can pay you back for their lives. No. Mm -mm. Ah, fine. I'll leave them alone. Drummer. Want me to do a drum roll? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Here we go. That was mm -hmm. great. Yeah, I know you'd like it. Yo. There's a party going on at the tavern tonight. The citizens rejoice, singing and dancing together into the night. Day 37 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus 10, and wealth minus 10. Okay, where's Pia? It's been two days now. <gasps> Boss, everybody get your suits on! Butler. Madam. I heard we are expecting an esteemed visitor from the Celestial Kingdom. Shall we go- shall I go about summoning the servants to prepare the castle for our guest? Yes. Mm. Make sure it's clean. Of course, of course. It is imperative that she'd be impressed. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? You've never done me wrong, wizard. I trust mm -hmm. you. Oh, interesting. Seems like it went well for you. Boots. Looks like he wants someone to pat his belly. 
Mm-hmm. Here where's Pia? Mod check. Chester. I accidentally ate some folks out front. You know, it happened. I was hungry. I saw... <laughs> some voluptuous... <laughs> villagers. Can I just pay you back with some gold? Yeah, you already did it. You already did the crime, man. Thanks for understanding. Skelly. Any mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fee if you're interested. Mm -hmm. I'll uncover the truth and report back to you. Okay, where's Pia? Where is she? Mod check. Day 38 complete. Population plus 15. Happiness plus 6. And wealth plus 240. Sneaky girl. Want me to steal from the rich and give it to you? Not just the rich. I'll steal from whoever, basically. No, we're having Pia come by today. We can't have criminals in the lobby. Taking the hybrid, huh? I'll see you around. Royal Advisor. A petition to bring the, cir the circus to town is circulating. Could attract tourists. Are you interested? We've had the circus, like, mm -hmm. every week <laughs> in our town. Let the people have their circus, then. It's almost like we have a Ren Fair, yeah? Also, I just noticed in the background of my town, there's no more construction being done. So this might be like the max maxed out kingdom. Little Fang. I am the dude of Spook. Do you want a spooky nickname? Yeah. Uh, you could be the Creep Queen. Yet, yet. Mom says I need your permission to go on an adventure. So can I? Please? Please? Why not, kid? Yeah, I'm so excited to go exploring. Royal Advisor. Builders wish to construct more houses in the town. They request gold, which they could build with which they could build much faster. Yeah, that's fine. I should bring this to them right away. Our city grows. Only $100 for houses? It's not bad. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. Okay, where's Pia? I'm waiting. Day 39 complete. Population plus 17, happiness plus 15, and wealth plus 10. Everybody suits on? Behave? Advisor Pia. Greetings. I am Pia, advisor to Ting Andromedus of the Celestial Kingdom. What a beautiful castle you have here. Everything is spotless. I was just wandering through your city. I was quite impressed with your citizens. You know, the Council of Crowns is searching for a fifth member. Is that something you might be interested in? Yes, 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 my life mm -hmm. dream. I thought as much. I'll inform King Andromedus. I'm sure he would be happy to meet you and discuss the details. Easy. Okay, so, plot twist. We will wait until the king comes and then we'll go downhill. Royal advisor. Oh my, was that woman from the Celestial Kingdom? This is so exciting. The Celestial King sits at the head of the Council of Crowns. Any connection with them will surely do as, as well in the future. Finally, some lore. After two hours, finally some lore. <laughs> Little Fang. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see death and misery. Bro, he killed 15 people. Little Timmy. Can I have a coin? A good coin? Yeah. Take this and run, mm -hmm. sucker. Yeah, thank you. Grandma. The soup shop's been doing well. I came to offer you some of our earnings. Thank you. Paying back mm -hmm. your business loan, finally. Very well. Here you are. $15? Bozo? That's not even half your loan. That's not even a tenth of your loan. 
Tiny cake. It's that slightly magical cat from before. Does this mean we're friends now? Obvi. Mm -hmm. I guess we are. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. Day 40 complete. Population minus 15, happiness plus 1, and wealth plus 24. Royal Advisor. I've collected some incomes from the circus. Would you like me to tax them? Yes. Tax the rich. Very well. The proceeds will be added to the treasury. Well, now we're adding more infrastructure to the town. Mulder, you ready for the truth? Aliens have already landed and they're in our city. You think we're safe? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think so too. Why would they want to harm us? Aliens are real, everybody. Monsieur Espiritu. Hmm. You call this a castle? But of course it is. Mm -hmm. It has walls, it has gold, it has a queen. Therefore, a castle. Indeed it is. Trick question. The Sultan. A caravan of mine wishes to camp in your city for the next few days. Might that be arranged? Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. Quite agreeable. We shall work together again, I hope. Little Timmy. Mwah. Can my friends come over to play? I mean, you should ask your mom. I'm not your mom. Mm -hmm. Thank you. The circus has packed up and left town, but not without leaving behind even more gold coins. The Sultan's caravan is resting in town. Our citizens have been trading with them, preventing a small amount of tax income. Day 41. Population plus 20, happiness plus 2, and wealth plus 135. Finally, we see this lady again. Gardener. We've completed work in the garden. Are you pleased? Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm so glad. Bummer that I don't get to see the garden. Monsieur Monton. Demand for my services is through the roof. May I have your permission to raise my prices? Yes, we need money. Mm -hmm. And that makes you happy? What? Do people love spending their money? Merci, merci. The Barber's Association thanks you. Boots. Can I have some food? Of course. Mm -hmm. Butler, there's a party I'd like to go to this evening, milady. Might I have the rest of the day off? Yes, it's already evening. You may go. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We will toast to your honor. Peace in. When are you getting your million dollar contract? You know, I can't say anything right now, but, you know, I signed an NDA. That would go crazy. I mean, if you have a hundred million dollars, then you literally don't have to do anything the rest of your life. And probably like your kids too. That's like an amount of money that's inconceivable. What's the first thing you'd get stream wise? I would get another monitor next to my TV so I could see chat better. And Probably like an actual PC. And I would give every single one of my followers a thousand dollars. Just kidding. I, I hate giving away money. <laughs> I'm not going to be Mr. Beast, okay? <laughs> Don't be using the chat. One thousand dollars for everybody. <laughs> Scientist. Hello, hello. The Council of Science has devised a blueprint for a gold-generating machine. It would take some time to construct, yes, yes, and many resources. But if my calculations are correct, at least we'll produce gold steadily for the rest of eternity. 
Perhaps you might initiate the project with a small research grant of 500 gold. Yes. Mm. I love printing money. Would you get a mod because I'm back on the market? <laughs> no, I would still never pay the mods. Just kidding, I would pay my mods. Good, good, yes. We'll begin some construction right away. Uh-oh. Loud noises are heard throughout the night coming from the Council of Science's chambers. The children have had a hard time sleeping. When he said money making machine, did he mean like human trafficking? Uh oh. Or maybe it's just gambling. And it's like the slot machines. Anyway. The Sultan's caravan is resting in town. Our citizens have been trading with them, providing a small amount of tax income. Okay, now it seems like there's more lore actually happening in the game. I think for certain events to trigger, you probably just need to hit certain like population count thresholds. So I want to keep going. <laughs> I just want to see what happens. Hmm, peace I too. Hmm. Day 42 complete. Population plus three, happiness plus 11, and wealth minus 437. Left little fang. I'm the Duke of Spook. Do you want a spooky nickname? Yeah, you're gonna call me Creep Queen. How did I know? Boots. Looks like he wants someone to pat his belly. Mm -hmm. Scientist. The gold generating machine project continues, my queen. Though, we are running slow on supplies. May, might we procure additional funding from you? A modest 100 gold would do much to help our operation. Okay, just 100 is fine. That's fine. I'll give you another grant. Very good indeed. Our efforts may continue unrestricted. Dude, he's going full lib. What happened to the mouse? Don't worry about it. You know, the cats might have gone a bit hungry. Kelly. Reporting in, I discovered an underground crime ring in the city's eastern ward. I have already taken steps to break up their operations. Could I have a bit of extra gold to bring in the guard and make some additional arrests? Imagine he arrests the scientists because they have a trafficking ring. Mm -hmm. Perfect. We'll have those criminals locked up by this time tomorrow. Monsieur Monton. Demand for my services is through the roof. May I have your permission to raise my prices? Yes, I love money. Mm-hmm. Merci, merci. The Barber's Association thanks you. The Sultan's caravan has left town. As a gesture of goodwill, they have left behind a small pouch of gold. Day 43 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus ten, and wealth minus seventy. Wizard, I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Why not? Mm -hmm. Oh, interesting. Seems like it went well for you. It's just like infinite money glitch. Can the wizard just come every day? Uh oh. Grandma. Oh dear. Those youngsters at the Council of Science are making quite a ruckus with their work. Could you tell them to keep it down? I would certainly appreciate it. She's going full caring. I can tell them to shut the fuck up, but you know, they're gonna give me money. Mm -hmm. so yes, I can tell them to be quiet. But it's just like a first grade classroom. They won't listen to you unless they respect you. Here's hoping those whippersnappers will listen. Royal advisor. Some villagers are threatening to leave unless we pay them a sum of gold. Should we listen to their demands? UBI does not work. Is what a Republican would say. No, no, I think UBI is fine. Because, in my opinion, it's either the government fully provi provides basic resources, so like money, or, <laughs> sorry, 
So like, the government provides basic resources, so maybe food stamps, water, electricity, and some form of like shelter monetary funding. But since none of the US does that, unless you're a brokey, I think UBI would work. Because if there is some form of like UBI, then everybody would be on the same playing field, right? Like, people could invest more time into personal development. They could invest more time into education, job trainings, better work. Dude, my stomach is growling so much. I'm, I, wait, when's the last time I ate? I had breakfast at 9. And then I had, I had watermelon. Oh, I didn't eat lunch. I'm fine, though. Do you think people would be lazier? No, that is a false conception. Because... It's not that people will be lazier, it's if people are given enough money to cover their basic necessities, then they're gonna have more spending money. They're gonna go out to eat more. They're gonna buy more luxury items. It's gonna boost the economy. Albeit temporarily. Well, cause this is why I hate the argument of like, like anecdotal wise. I was talking about this with my friend the other day because, like, they were, like, talking about, like, oh, everybody who's on government assistance or food stamps is too lazy to, like, get a job. And it's like, that's not what it's for. That's a very small minority. Like, it's meant so people don't fucking die. That's what the government resources are intended for, right? But even if UBI only covered your essentials, right, you'd still want to have a work. Or you'd still want to have a job, that way you can buy luxury items, that way you can buy, like, takeout, that way you can, like, go to nicer restaurants, you can buy nice things for yourself. UBI is not meant to cover your chosen non-essential purchases. You would need the pressure of having to work. I mean, then just don't accept the UBI. Maybe it's opt-in. Hmm. I mean, opt-in, I think, would make the most sense. Because, you know, the rich people would be too prideful to apply. I don't know. <laughs> I would- You would buy Pokemon cards with the UBI? Dude, we should banish you. Okay, anyway. Some villagers are threatening to leave unless you pay them with a sum of gold. Should we listen to their demands? Okay. It's some villagers. It's not all of them. They can leave. I'm only gonna do UBI if everybody gets gold. So I'm, I'm gonna say no. I'm a socialist, but since only like some are asking for gold, they need to bring like an actual proposed legislation to me. Mm -mm. I see. We'll let them go then. You'd make enough money to get by and then use the government money to buy candy? <laughs> you could open a candy store with all the candy you could buy with the government money. <gasps> oh, I thought he's- never mind. Scientist. The gold generating machine project continues, my queen. Though, we are running low on supplies. Might we procure additional funding from you? A modest hunter's gold would do much help to our operation. Yeah. You asked that yesterday. Mm -hmm. Very good indeed, indeed. Our efforts may continue unrestricted. I, no, hey, you gotta tone it down. <gasps> Holy. Saturn. The boundary of your expanding city is beginning to conflict with the border of my nation. More specifically, your workers have begun constructing a fence in my backyard. No, I did not say to build a wall, guys. I did not say build a wall. This is... This is made even more affronting by the fact that my backyard is underwater. I demand that you cease construction of this fence and maintain your border at its current position. Yeah, that's totally valid. I'm sorry about my workers who are building a wall. That is wrong of them. I am sorry. I will cease construction. Mm -hmm. Good. Now if you'll excuse me, I've got some cleaning up to do around my property. Day 44 complete. Population plus 14, happiness plus 8, and wealth plus 0.
Royal Advisor. Since we opened our borders, trade from our caravans have increased dramatically. Do you wish to tax the merchants? Yes, tax the rich. <laughs> I will collect a fee from the traders. Blacksmith. My sales have brought in record profits, and I'd like to give you something as thanks. Will you accept my gift? Yes. Anything. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Future employer, I am not against government assistance, and I don't think people are lazy. I'm just trying to start a conversation. Peace, I do, pride. <laughs> I mean, but wouldn't your opinion, Mac, the employers would love because they know that you'd keep working under their ire? Their ire? Monsieur Monton. Citizens from far and wide come to visit my barber shop. Would you like a fresh cut, madame? Free of charge. As long as I don't look like you, man. Mm -hmm. Of course you do. You look dashing. I look exactly the same. Chester. I'm hungry. Can I eat some, folks? I got plenty of gold so I can pay you back for their lives. No. Mm -mm. No. It's fine. I'll leave him alone, then. Yeah, get out of here. Why haven't we locked him up yet? Pancake. It's that slightly magical cat from before. Does this mean we're friends now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I guess we are. My sister's adorable. Nobody leaked this story. But we went to the Daiso store yesterday, and they had like plushies right in the front. And I told her, I was like, no, or don't buy the, it's not in the budget. Granted, she was buying, so she can buy her what she wants. I was like, do not buy one, you do not need it. So we, we buy everything else, we got some like, we got some new dishes, we got some like snacks. And she loops back around to the stuffed animals, and I'm like, oh no. Because <laughs> I'm looking around the store, trying to find her, and she's by the stuffed animal show. And she she has this like loaf one and it's black and white. And she's like, isn't this one cute? And I'm like, yeah. And she's like, I wanna get it so I can like pretend it's a real cat, because I want a cat so bad. Oh, it was cute. Guys, can can I can we get to a million subs so I can buy a mansion? And then me and my sister can have cats. One day. Cause like, it, it's cute because like my sister isn't very affectionate. Like she doesn't do hugs or anything. But she will be like super gentle with animals and it's cute. When it comes time to renew the rental, will cats come into the equation? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Because, like, honestly, if we had a cat, then I would take care of it. And that's the problem. <laughs> it's like the bozos can't even take off the fucking trash. Okay, anyway, back to work. Day 45 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus three, and wealth plus 140. You know what could increase my personal happiness? Following the channel, because everybody, we are another 30 minutes in the stream. So if you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. And if you're already following, make sure your notifications turned on. That way you don't miss a single stream. Because today was a bonus weekend stream, so unscheduled. So if you didn't have a notification, you would not know that I'm live. VOD watchers? VOD check? Um, type 1 if you watch the VODs. <laughs> Back to it. We gotta get this king to show up. Oh my god, oh my god! Okay. Advise Pia. Make way, make way for King Andromedus, Lord of the Celestial Kingdom. King Andromedus, you don't always need to make such a fuss about my entrances, Pia. Anyway, yes, hello, good queen. I've heard much about you and your people. We in the council are quite impressed with you and would love to induct you. There's just one small issue. All four of the existing council members must be present to induct a new member, but 
I'm afraid Queen Chanterelle and Queen Seren are having a bit of a fight at the moment. We need to calm them down and settle their dispute before you can join the council. You should be hearing from their advisors shortly. I'm entrusting you with the task of reconciling the two queens. Best of luck to you. And afterwards, that seat on the council shall be yours. Hi, Angie. Welcome in. Thank you. I got this from Spirit Halloween last Halloween. I was saving it for this stream. But welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Okay, so lore update. Now we gotta... We literally have to mend the tensions between foreign entities so they don't do a nuclear war. Okay, Royal Advisor. I'll keep an eye out for the advisors from the Ocean Kingdom and Plant Kingdom, madam. Oh, wait. Didn't I just build a fence on the Mr. Mermaid Man's turf? Uh-oh. He might not like this. Oh, in the Plant Kingdom, we literally chopped down all the trees they have. Ooh. I'm sure we can settle whatever it is that's troubling their queens. Petite Saurus. It's the same mask from before. Is he offering me something? Mm -hmm. Oh, he found a coin. Scientist. Progress continues on the gold generating machine, my queen. We are, however, a bit low on staff. Might I request a donation of a few skilled workers? Anything for the gold machine, my good scientist? Mm -hmm. Wonderful. This will keep us on track. Yes, yes, it will. What is this game? I'm a queen, and I have to make diplomatic decisions so my castle doesn't fail. I have to maintain population, happiness, approval ratings, and wealth. And we were going to throw like 30 minutes ago, but there's like actual lore happening now. Mulder. Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're going to want to hire me. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go investigate something. Have you played King of the Castle? No, I have not. If it's like a RPG, then maybe I'll play it. I love story shit too. Okay. Madame Abiel. My assistant and I have found a way to make some extra gold by trading sweets. Are you interested? Yes. Mm -hmm. I thought you might be. We can make quite a bit of money this way. Ooh, cute. Fisherman reports seeing schools of dancing mermaids in the water, raising their spirits. Day 46 complete. Population minus 4, happiness plus 2, and wealth plus 145. Petite Saurus. It's the same mouse from before. Is he offering me something? Oh, he found a coin. Oh, wait, is King of the Castle? I think I saw someone play it on stream a while ago. I, I definitely will play more viewer interacting type games when I have a larger um, following. Because I think it's a lot more fun when you have somebody who has like... At least like... Uh, like... 500 viewers. Because then like... The dynamic I think is a lot more interesting. It's kind of like how when you see like channel point predictions and then you see like a million versus two million on both sides. It's more like... It feels like there's more... It feels like a bigger stake. I don't know. But thank you for the suggestion. We could definitely save that for... When I get my 100 million contract. We'll do it for that stream. <laughs> okay. How's your laptop been? Ooh, she is burning up. But I... The only issue we had was when OBS disconnected. But that's not the laptop's fault. That's just OBS hating me. So, like, performance-wise, it's doing it okay. She hasn't overheated yet. Mulder. I'm back. I discovered an alien conspiracy to cover up large amounts of gold. Do you believe in aliens? Obviously, I love aliens. Mm -hmm. Good to know there are other believers out there. Oh, I just noticed. See how there's, like, orchards and trees in the background of the pavilion? That's the garden, finally. Scientist. 
We are making great strides on the gold generating machine project, my queen. However, an additional round of funding would go a long way for us overworked scientists. Might you be so kind to part with 300 gold coins to aid our efforts? Uh, you keep on asking for money and I keep on giving it to you. We love government grant programs, but come on, you gotta show some results. I don't want to see satellites keep on blowing up in outer space. Mm -hmm. As I had hoped, your generosity will be rewarded in due time. You better give me like a million dollars when this project is over. Georgie. Hey, uh, good friend. I thought you might be interested in making a deal. A good, wholesome, friendly deal. Yeah, and angels such as myself could offer you a lot of happiness. It would cost you some gold, though. How about this? A few hundred gold from you, and I'll make sure your citizens are happy. Dude, they're already happy. Fuck off. I can mm -hmm. see that it's a costume. Dang it! What's a guy gotta do to make a deal around here? Little Timmy. Mwah. Can my friends come over to play? I'm like, ask your mother. I'm not your mother. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. Nice voice acting. Thank you. <laughs> you know, I think it's fun to do voices. Even though I'm not, like, correct at it, I think it's funny. Day 47 complete. Population plus 3, happiness plus 3, and wealth minus 2, 45. Royal Advisor. Villagers are complaining about garbage in the streets. Shall we hire workers to clean it up? Yes. I don't want to be like LA. Mm -hmm. The villagers' noses will thank you, surely. I've never been to LA. I just hear the jokes, okay? Little Fang. You feeling... Spooky today? No. Mm -hmm. You did not eat one of my civilians today. Not even a little tiny spook? Little baby bat? Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Yes, I would love a hundred dollars. <gasps> oh, my apologies. I guess the spell turned out to be evil. Literally, the ten other times, he gave me money. And now he fucking killed ten people. Banish this bozo. <gasps> Holy! Mercury. Hello. I am from the neighboring Ocean Kingdom. What a lovely castle you have. Although it is quite dry. Have you ever been to the Ocean Kingdom? No, I have not. All I do is sit my fat ass on this throne. But I would love to visit. Mm -mm. Oh, I see. Not much of a swimmer, are you? I can't fault you for that, I suppose. I didn't want to lie. Boots. Can I have some food? Mm. Yes, sir. Scientists have constructed a large factory to further their work on the gold generating machine. Pollution becomes a problem for nearby homes. Is this talking about big corporations dumping toxic waste into the lakes and rivers? That is not me. I'm, I'm not doing that. Ooh, all on the negative. Day 48 complete. Population minus 10, happiness minus 19, and wealth minus 52. Ooh. Butler. Um, might I get a cup of tea for you, my lady? Why not? Mm -hmm. Start off the day right. Ah, uh -huh, yes. Nice and hot, madame. Monsieur Spirit. Good day, madam. Do you require any haunting services for a small price? I'll scare some people for you. No, you killed mm -hmm. people last time. Very well. Very well. <gasps> Scientist. I can. I can hardly believe it, my queen, but we've finally done it. The construction of the gold generating machine has been completed. All that remains is to turn it on. It will take a couple of days before it becomes operational, but we will begin the process tonight. Won't be long now. No, no. Dude, what? I guess we gotta wait a few more days, guys. 
We've invested like literally a thousand dollars into this gold making machine. It better be good. The Sultan. I've got a business proposition for you in your tiny little town. Are you interested? Yes. Mm -hmm. Huh. I'll bring you details soon. Little Fang. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see death and misery. The Council of Silence celebrates as the gold generating machine steadily builds a power. Dude, they're gonna become too drunk to run the machines. They can't be high on the job. Day 49 complete. Population minus 15, happiness minus 11, and wealth minus 3. If it turns out that the gold making machine does not work, I'm gonna be so mad. <gasps> Blacksmith, it's finally done. I finished crafting the dragon blade. All we need now is someone to wield it. I'll leave it here with you and spread the word to our heroes. If they wish to take up the blade, I'll send them here to you. Petite Saurus. It's the same mask from before. Is he offering me something? Mm -hmm. Oh, he found a coin! Jester. I do believe I've perfected my show. Gold does require, but happiness it shall bring. Oh, 700 gold, my lord, and I can put on my show once more. Okay, honestly, the Jester show does not generate a lot of revenue for the city. All it does is make the population happy, and I'm fine with losing fine happiness if I can save $700, okay? I'm sorry, but I cannot invest that much. 700? Yeah, he's crazy. Does he not see that I only have 200 bucks? Mm -hmm. No, I'm sorry. See, look, only one person was sad. Only one little child was sad that the jester does not show up again. Oh, no! I'm sorry. 700 is too much. Monsieur Monton, demand for my services is through the roof. May I have your permission to raise my prices? Yes, tax the rich. Mm -hmm. Merci, merci. The Barber's Association thanks you. Butler. That man you hired earlier has gone missing, madam. Shall we send a search party? Wait, who? Uh-oh. I hired so many people. Yes? We must find him at all costs. Who went missing? The Council of Science celebrates as the gold generating machine steadily builds a power. Day 50 complete. Population minus one, happiness plus three, and wealth plus 45. Ooh. Advisor Pontus. Good day. I am advisor Pontus of the Ocean Kingdom. Recently, a dispute has been raised between our queen and the plant kingdom. A plot of marshland has been discovered and must be legally marked as one of kingdom's property. Since the marsh contains water, clearly it must belong to the Ocean Queen. The plant queen refuses to listen to reason, however, and insists it should be hers. Will you support our claim to the marshland? Will you help the Ocean Kingdom? Okay, a marsh isn't ocean. You know, I need the other representative. Yeah, I agree. Marshland is more vegetation. Like, when I think marsh, I think swamp. And I don't think marshlands are near oceans. I think they're more near, like, rivers and lakes. So I think they are being silly billies. But I want them to like me. So I will support your claim. Mm -hmm. Of course, of course. I'll bring word of your support to Queen Sedith. With you on our side, we should be able to overpower the plant kingdom and take that marsh.
scientist. Our work is finally complete. The gold generating machine has been activated. All we need to do now is sit back and enjoy the fruits of our labor. Many thanks to you, my queen, for supporting us in this project. Ooh! Gardener. Some plant people have sprouted in the gardens. Are we allowed to make them official citizens? Yes, if it'll up our population count, why not? Mm-hmm. I will inform them at once. Which? The spirits are appeased right now, but perhaps we should grant them an offering of gold. I know the spirit world always appreciates gold, and it might prevent them from haunting us in the future. What do you say? 200 gold to be a decent offering? No. Wait, is the ghost haunting me? Is the guy who asked, is this a castle? <clears throat> it probably is, because we haven't had any other ghosts besides that one guy. Nothing for now, then. I'll let you know if anything changes with the spirit world. Madame Abiel. Bonjour! Proceeds from the candy trade have been rolling in steadily. Do you wish to collect your taxes? Yes. I love money. Here is your share. A group of mermaid traders made a visit to our market today, resulting in slightly increased trade profits. Very nice. A shiny golden statue pops out of the gold generating machine. Looks like it's pretty valuable. Day 51 complete. Population plus 5, happiness plus 1, and wealth plus 145. The Sultan. How about this? Give me 200 gold, and I'll provide a large shipment of luxury goods. No, I don't need that shit. Mm -mm. Very well. Perhaps another day we can arrange something. Monsieur Aspirant. Good day, madam. Do you require any haunting services for a small price? I'll scare some people for you. No. Mm -mm. Very well. Very well. Royal Advisor. There's a very stinky kid running around the streets. Should we force her to have a bath? Yeah. That's mm -hmm. neglect. Glad you agree. She won't be happy, though. And she's gonna spread disease. Winston. Hey, uh, somebody came by and cleaned up my home. You gonna pay me back for that? Yeah? Mm -hmm. I guess this'll do. Why did somebody clean your home? Mulder. Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're going to want to hire me. Oh, wait, was Mulder the one who went missing? Oopsie. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, no, was it? Scully. I'm going to go investigate something. We haven't seen Scully in a while. The gold generating machine spits out a small bunch of coins into the night. Hmm, seems like the gold machine gives me something every day. I can make other return on the investment in probably two months. Because it was a thousand dollars I invested. Day 52 complete. Population zero, happiness minus one, wealth plus zero. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? You better not fuck me over this time, man. Mm -hmm. Oh, interesting. Seems like it went well for you. It better have. <gasps> oh no. Advisor Agric. Um, hello. My name is Advisor Agric. I represent the plant queen, Shantarev. We heard your announcement of support for the Ocean Kingdom in this matter of marshland. As a land filled with grasses and plant life, that marsh rightfully belongs to the plant queen. I will give you a chance to correct your mistake and announce your support for us instead. Make the right choice now. Will you back the plant kingdom instead? Yes, I'll play both sides. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Very good, as it should be. I will inform Queen Chanterelle of your choice. I'm a double agent, baby. Scientist. So how do you win this game? You don't. <laughs> this game is endless. Yeah. So I'm 
I'm actually during the next ad break, I'm gonna look up like how long to get the main stuff in. Cause like the first two hours were just grinding money and population, but now we're like getting more like politics and shit. Scientists. Hello, hello. The Council of Science has developed a new potion in need of testing. May we have permission to conduct a test with a willing participant? I can't believe you support stealing land. No, I revoked my stance on it. I support the tree kingdom now. You know, if that participant is doing it for the greater good and they sign a waiver, I think that is fine. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yes, yes. I will report back to you with news of the potions of eggs. Chester. Hey, I accidentally ate some folks up front again. Can I just pay you back with gold? Yeah, you fucker. Mm -hmm. Thanks for understanding. He needs to be jailed for real. Oh, well, Skelly's back. Hi, Skelly. Skelly. Any mysteries of what? I can do some snooping for a small fee if you're interested. Why not? Mm -hmm. I'll uncover the truth and report back to you. The gold generating machine spits out a small pouch of coins in the night. Day 53 complete. Population plus 15, happiness plus 5, and wealth plus 260. Scientist. We seem to have invented a potion that magically styles the drinker's hair. We'll sell the formula for a good price. Uh oh, the barber man's gonna go out of business and he's gonna be so mad. Royal Advisor. Since we opened our borders, trade from our caravans have increased dramatically. Do you wish to tax the merchants? Yes, tax the rich. Mm -hmm. I will collect a fee from the traders. You're stealing people's jobs with technology? No, that is innovation. Innovation is necessary for the advancement of society. You can get a new job, bozo. We love automation. Dude, this is back in the medieval ages. We're literally throwing shit in buckets onto the street. Any type of automation is good. <laughs> Grandma. Hello, sweetie. Can I borrow a coin for the newspaper? Yeah, I'd take this. Mm -hmm. Thank you, dearie. I went to school to write code and chat. GBT took my job. Just become a streamer. Easy. <laughs> Ooh, new new dialogue. Sneaky girl. The new high school or the new high class housing district looks interesting. Bet there's lots of cool stuff to find there. Think I can borrow the key to the upper district gate? No! Mm -hmm. Why? How are you so brazen to do crimes? Not very trusting, are you? Yeah, why would I give you the key to steal? Skelly. Reporting in. I solved the mystery about who stole Miss Pumpkin's baking pan. Want me to turn him in? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's off to the dungeon for him. The gold generating machine spits out a small pouch of coins in the night. Day 54 complete. Population minus one, happiness plus two, and wealth plus 149. Little Timmy. Mwah. Can my friends come over to play? Where's your parents? Mm -hmm. Or maybe he's an orphan. That lives on the castle steps every night. Thank you. Uh-oh. Is he gonna...
Okay, chat, if you hear me, type 69. Type 69. 69. 69. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're back, baby. We're back. And it's OBS. Literally, my bitrate drops to zero. It drops to zero for two seconds. It's not my internet. It's not my fucking internet. Because if it was my internet, then I wouldn't be able to type in chat. I use OBS. This has only been happening during the update. Hmm, peace I too. Hmm. Thank you guys for holding. But, like I said earlier, what is good is when it does DC, it keeps the VOD up. Like, it keeps the stream up. Maybe it was part of the new update. I don't know. Anyway, back to it. Stumpy. Another chapter in the rebuilding of our people's bonds have been penned this day. I've spoken with your mason on the topic of sustainable construction techniques, though... He was not at first wholly receptive to my ideologies. In due time, I did convince him to see things my way. I thank you for your cooperation, such as it has been in this matter. <laughs> Wait, I just saw Max reply. <laughs> I'm just playing around. I'm making a contrarian to keep conversation going. That is literally all Mac does in stream. Mac will think of like the most nitpicky, obscure arguments sometimes. But it, it does work. It does keep the combo going. And I love debate Andy's low-key. Because I myself am a debate Andy. As long as you don't bring the LGBTQ tag up again. We're, we are not starting that debate again. Mason. Hey, uh, a very talkative tree stump just came by to give me an earful. It was saying something about not cutting down so many trees, I think. What's the deal? Do I have to listen to that thing? Yes, I don't want the downy overrun. Really? We're taking orders from trees now? Is he racist? Well, you're the boss. This will slow down our construction some, but I can't just say no to you, ma'am. Yeah, I'm the queen. Listen to me. Also, like, look how much nicer the houses are now. He's treeist. Yeah, we should cancel him. Cancel Mason. Everybody, get your Twitter fingers ready. Royal Advisor. A petition to bring the circus to town is circulating. Could attract tourists. Are you interested? Yes, I love the circus. Mm -hmm. Let the people have their circus, then. Why does she sound always so disappointed whenever I bring the circus in? Maybe she just hates clowns. Chester, I'm hungry. Can I eat some folks? I got plenty of gold so I can pay you back for their lives. No. Mm -mm. Ah, fine. I'll leave them alone. Little Timmy, Mwah. can I have a coin? A gold coin? Mm -hmm. Yeah, go get yourself a gumbo. Yeah, thank you. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. The gold generating machine spits out a small pouch of coins in the night. Day 55 complete. Population plus 13, happiness plus 20, and wealth plus 114. Speaking of advising, it's time for some ads, everybody. Because we are three hours into stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5.00. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub available after the ad. We will see how much longer this game is because I am hungry. <laughs> but we'll see, we'll see. Maybe we can save this for another day. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, get some more, get a snack. I'm going to fix my crown a bit. You're really enjoying this? Me too. I'm, I'm just, like, happy that there's more, like, lore happening. Okay, that's a bit better. That's better than here, right? Yeah. It's because, like, with this setup, since I'm playing a game on my computer, I can't see my camera preview. Okay, let us see how long this game is. 
Oh, let's put the music back on. Let's see. Sort the court game length. Okay, so it's not necessarily how many hours it takes. Okay, so kind of like the main end game is joining the city council or the crown council. And some people say it takes 70 game days in game. So I guess we'll keep going until we beat it. Cause if we're at if we're at day fifty five, then I'm about like two thirds of the way there. There. So maybe maybe I just need to like speed run. Also, chatters, if you're new here, follow the channel. You get cool emotes. And if you're already following, make sure you have notifications turned on. Hmm. I we'll keep going. I I want to join the the court. And then we'll burn this kingdom to the ground. Get back to work. Oh my god, oh my god, wait, 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 wait. King Adromedus. Hello, good queen. It seems the trouble regarding that marshland has been cleared up. Once Queen Chantanel realized she won, she was willing to split the marsh with the Ocean Kingdom. Wait, so playing both sides was right. Sometimes the leader just needs a bit of respect, you know? Well, either way, your input helped break the stalemate. For that, I'm thankful. Now as promised, your seat on the council. I'll have Pia make the final arrangements and inform you when you're ready to induct you. Thank you again for your assistance in this matter. Yes! That easy. See, if we would have quit 30 days, then we would never would have joined the council, guys. I knew I should have kept on playing. Not that you guys wanted me to stop. <laughs> I don't think anybody wanted me to stop playing. Little Fang. I'm the Duke of Spook. Do you want a spooky nickname? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Huh. You can be the creep queen. So original. Muncia Spirit. Hmm. You call this a castle? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. It's my castle. Indeed it is. Trick question. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Why not? Mm -hmm. Oh, a spell of great fortune. Ooh, plus 200 that time. Nice. Ooh, Lord. Scientist. I couldn't help but notice that most interesting cog you've come to possess, Queen. Might I use it for something? I ask for no gold as of it, simply the use of that cog. Yes? It's just sitting there anyway. You better not break it. It is very special to me. Yes, yes. I must convey to you the greatest gratitudes. We shall create something wonderful with this. What if the robot comes back for it? No, he said it was a gift. So I think it's fine. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. The gold generating machine spits out a small bunch of coins in the night. Day 56 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus five, and wealth plus 230. Royal advisor. There's been a brawl at the tavern. Should we arrest those responsible for starting it? Yes, lock them up. Mm -hmm. I should have them arrested at once. Holder. I couldn't uncover anything. I was being followed too risky. 
Did you see anyone follow me out of the castle? No, sir. Mm -mm. I suspected as much. Very suspicious. Blacksmith. Would you like to purchase any swords for your guards? A well-protected city is a happy city. Weren't you working for me for free? Like, aren't you the castle's armory? Mm -hmm. Oh, $20? Never mind, that's not bad. That's, like, nothing. Great. I'll have a shipment of swords sent to your barracks. Madame Abil. I accidentally stayed up all night eating candies. Can I have some gold to go to the doctor? Fucking dumbass bitch, mm -hmm. stop eating candy. I never thought I could eat too many sweets. Sneaky girl. Want me to steal from the rich and give to you? Not just the rich, I'll steal from whoever, basically. No. Mm -mm. Taking the high road, huh? I'll see you around. The circus has packed up and left town, but not without leaving behind even more gold coins. The gold generating machine spits out a small patch of coins in the night. Day 57 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus 11, and wealth plus 10. Skelly. Some of the villagers mentioned they saw an alien walking around. You know anything about this? No. Mm -mm. Oh, fuck, it's not that I don't believe them. I just haven't heard rumors. Damn it. Are you suggesting your townspeople are liars? Interesting. That's not what I meant. Oh. Alien. Thanks for covering for me. I knew I could count on you. Okay, maybe that's good. Monsieur Monton. Citizens from far and wide come to visit my barbershop. Would you like a fresh cut, madame? Free of charge. Mm. I just don't want to look like a scrub. Of course you do. You look dashing. Jester. I do believe I've perfected my show. Gold it does require, but happiness it shall bring. Oh, 700 gold, my lord. And I can put on my show once more. Okay, I have a lot of money now. I'll do it. I'll do it. Jester's been good. He keeps everybody happy. They all laugh at him. He's good. Oh, the show will be a delight and astound. <laughs> Little Fang. Hello, friend. Get to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see. Fame and fortune for you. Thank you for clocking in, Angie. <laughs> Even though you clocked in late. You got a write up next time. Madame Abiel. Bonjour. Proceeds with the candy trade I've been rolling in steadily. Do you wish to collect your taxes? I love taxes. Mm -hmm. Here is your share. I will sing a song? Ain't no way. We can do that. Once I finish this day, though. The dragon blade lies useless without a master. Some are beginning to lose hope that the dragon will never be slain. We haven't seen the dragon. Don't worry about it. The gold generating machine makes a loud thumping noise and outpours just a large quantity of gold coins. Ooh, plus 150. Another one? The gold generating machine spits out a small patch of coins in the night. Day 58 complete. Population plus zero, happiness plus seven, and wealth minus 425. See, I knew that machine was worth it. I always know what's best. Okay, let's sing a song. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can't Let's see, let's find a song.
I kind of want to do a 21 pilot song. It's been a while. Okay, I think I'm going to do the second verse and chorus for Shy Away by Twin Impalas. If everybody could spam your favorite hype emotes, your favorite animated emotes, that'd be great. If you want to see other previous singing clips, I have a playlist on YouTube. Okay, I have to look at the lyrics a little bit. Dude, my hair is whack right now. I didn't put any product in today. <laughs> okay. <laughs> When you get home, you barely recognize the pictures they put in a frame. Cause you shed your modesty, don't circle the track. Take what you have, and leave your skin on the floor. Don't you shy away. And manifest a ceiling when you shy away Searching for that feeling just like an I love you That isn't words Like a song he wrote That's never heard When I get home Boy, you better not be there You're long gone Shed your modesty don't circle the track, just break the cycle in half And leave your skin on the floor There we go. I actually did part of the third bridge. Um, that was... Here, I'll show it. Um, Do Not Disturb is enabled. This is... Shy Away by 21 Pilots. I think it was one of the first few singles from that album. Don't you shy away. The manifest a ceiling. But thank you for redeeming Angie. Finally a singing clip. It's been a while since somebody's redeemed sing a song. It's been like a week. But thank you. Don't you shy away The manifest is sealing Get back to work. We're gonna join the council. Holy! Gardener. The plant people citizens have taken root and grown into a lovely field of flowers. Can you hear them rejoicing? Yes. Mm-hmm. They are so happy to see the beautiful plants. Hello, Fang. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah. I see death and misery. Royal advisor. A petition to bring the circus to town is circulating. Could attract tourists. Are you interested? Always, I love the circus! Let the people have their circus, then. Grandma. Oh, dear. I read quite the troubling take in the paper today. Think everything will be alright? Yes, don't listen to the propaganda you read in the paper. Mm -hmm. I hope you're right. I will start a revolution against you all. Not if I ban you! Just kidding, hi, Sinisters. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Hello, Mo. <laughs> you know I wouldn't do that. Unless... <laughs> Mason. As our city continues to expand, I'd like to embark on a project that's a bit more... Ambitious. For a daily allowance of 100 gold, my workers can begin the grueling task of remodeling our town's central plaza. This will surely elevate our city to new heights, though it may take several days to complete. What do you think? Oh, okay, I thought it was like forever. But if it's only like five days, that's 500 bucks, that's not bad. What would my role be if I was a person in the game? Jester, obviously. You're a clown. <laughs> Mic drop. <laughs> Dude, I forgot. I literally made a scepter for today. 
because I was gonna like hold this in one hand and then use my other hand to do the keyboard, but this is too heavy. I made this prop in like 10 minutes and I barely used it. I mean, it's cute. Good, good. I'll have the logistics of the project finally soon and we'll begin work soon. My kingdom is really pretty though. The Mason Central Plaza or the Mason Central Plaza renovation is progressing, bringing more attention to the city's downtown area. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. Where's the Pikachu? I just realized it's gone. I think it fell off like almost two months ago and I haven't retaped it, mainly because I want you guys to see the paintings more so. You know, um, exclamation shop and chat everybody, new painting drop coming out at the end of the month. If you use code TWITCH10, you get $10 off your purchase today. Also, Mac, submit the review. You need to do that. And if you give me one star, you're banned. I always forget. Do it now. What should I say? Be like, it looks amazing in person. Smile. The photos don't do it justice. Which I think is true. Not gonna lie. The chrome effect is really hard to get on camera. Anyway. Back to work. Let me join this council. Are you able to upload photos? I don't know, because the review function for the Shopify is a third party thing, so I can't change any of the UI that you guys see, or a customer sees. Military General. A nearby town has asked us to form an alliance with them. Should we use them to beef up our ranks? Yes. Mm -hmm. I love global globalization. Sounds good to me. More swords for us. Peanut. He's got a shiny coin. I'll take that. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to leave a review. Bro, it's so easy. You just say what you liked, and if there's anything to critique, you say what to critique. Okay, example. When I bought the cake, I left a review like a week after, and I said the cake was delicious. It looked very similar to the picture, the only thing I didn't like was the sprinkles. So maybe if you have a hard sprinkle texture, put it in the description. That'd be great. Otherwise, it was delicious best cake I've ever had. Smile. And then I got a coupon. Yet, yet. I'm back. I found these shiny yellow stones. Pretty cool, right? Dude, he's been gone for like a week. Dude, he's been... I thought he was lost. Mm -hmm. So cool. Little Fang. You feeling spooky today? No. Mm -mm. Not even a tiny spook? Little baby bat? Well, I don't think it should show your contact info, but for all of the reviews on my website, I have to approve them. So if, if it does show personal information, I just wouldn't publish it. Oh, it asks for your email most likely to verify your purchase. So use the same email that you used for your transaction. That way, it's probably to prevent like shops from getting bombarded by fake reviews. Most likely. Okay, anyway, back to it. Fisherman, new character. My boat's too tiny to catch many fish. Can I have some gold to upgrade it? I'll pay you back, I swear. Ooh, whenever they say I swear, they're capping. But you know, I'm rich. Oh, you won't regret this. You'll see. He's never gonna pay me back. The Mason's Central Plaza renovation is progressing, bringing more attention to the city's downtown area. The circus is in town, bringing joy to all those who visit. It also happens to bring in a nice bit of gold. The gold generating machine spits out a small patch of coins in the night. Day 60 complete. Population plus 18, happiness plus 11, and wealth minus 105. Okay, I want to join the council. <gasps> oh my god, it's no way, no way, no way, no way. Advisor Pia. Good day, madam. We're ready to officially induct you into the Council of Crowns. 
there are a few formalities to observe. Can I skip over those and give you the short version? Oh. Because it's kind of like when you skip through the terms of service, they'll, they'll be like one gotcha. Where it's like, oh, it's like a million dollar entry fee. I assume if I press no, she'll just give me like more dialogue. And that's fine. I'm gonna say no. Mm -mm. Sigh, well, all right. Hope you're comfortable up there. Here we go. Okay, thank God, thank God. Here we go, gather around everybody. I, Pia, of the Celestial Kingdom, do hereby call this court to session. The matter at hand is the joining of this queen to our esteemed Council of Crowns. As a formally appointed advisor, I speak with the authority of the Celestial Kingdom. For ages, the Council has joined kings and queens from across the globe in alliances. I offer my blessing on behalf of the Celestial Kingdom and ask that all of the advisors present do so as well. Advisor Algric. I, Algric, or I, Algric, of the Plant Kingdom, do hereby offer my support for this candidate. Advisor Pontus. I, Pontus, of the Ocean Kingdom, do hereby offer my support for this candidate. Oh, so he was not a fraud. I, Yarna, of the Comfy Kingdom, do hereby offer my support for this candidate. I told you I was the true advisor of the Comfy Kingdom. Yarno out. Advisor Pia. Um, yes. Where was I? Oh, yes. Here we go. With the support of all existing council kingdoms, you are granted the right to join. I offer you this ceremonial coin, as has been offered to you to gen- I offer you this ceremonial coin, as has, as has been offered to generation of queens before you. Huzzah! Guys, plus one. Now, you've been officially inducted. I must now call on the members of the council themselves to greet you. I told you there would be formalities. Try not to fall asleep. King Ajomatus, I ask that you come forward. Queen Ajomatus, welcome, queen, to the council. We're happy to have you. I look forward to the shared success of our kingdoms. Holy! Dude, she looks like she's straight out of Pixie Hollow. Oh my god. And I loved that shit when I was younger. Anyway, focus. Queen Santorell. I, Queen Santorell of the Plant Kingdom, do welcome you to our council. May your roots grow strong and your leaves, and your leaves reach high. I loved Ursula. Queen Sereth. Hello. I'm Queen Sereth, ruler of the Ocean Kingdom. As the tides change, so does our council. We are happy to have you. King Pin. Greetings. I am King Pin of the Comfy Kingdom. Welcome to the council. Sorry about Yarno. He can be a bit of a goof. He's harmless, though. Just a troublemaker. The real fellow to look out is for that button boy. That darn button has been trying to rob Yarno of his position for years. Apologies. This is your ceremony. I shouldn't be talking about personal matters. Yeah, his design is cool. Like, his body is a... Is a... Stool... A, a stool? A thread? You've got my blessing, of course. Welcome. Advisor Pia. Is that everybody? That was so long. Well, it's done. I hereby call to end this session of the court. Thanks for staring awake. I know that ceremony can be quite tiring. Now that you're part of the council, representatives from other kingdoms may come to you for help. Make sure you do your best to assist them. And sincerely, congratulations. The council is the highest rank to which a queen can rise. Sir Tortuga. Um, greetings. Hello. I am Sir Tortuga of the Shell Knights. We fight for all that is good and righteous. Is there anything, um, you might need assistance with here, madam? Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, very good. 
We'll set about it at once. We are a very helpful bunch, you'll see. Monsieur Monton. Demand for my services is through the roof. May I have your permission to raise my prices? Why not? Mm -hmm. Merci, merci. The Barber's Association thanks you. Mulder. Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're going to want to hire me. Mm -hmm. Mulder's never done me wrong. I'm going to go investigate something. Gardener. Would you like to buy some flowers from our garden? They're a special low price for you, madame. Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. Flowers are so lovely. Um, congratulations. By joining the Council of Crowns, you've completed the game. You can continue to play as long as you want to wrap up any loose ends. Finally. The Mason's Central Plaza renovation is progressing, bringing more attention to the city's downtown area. The circus has packed up and left town, but not without leaving behind even more gold coins. Day 61 complete. Population plus 3. Happiness plus 11 and wealth minus 44. 61 days and I joined the Crown Council. I joined the United Nations, everybody. I am a diplomat. I am a real queen. And you know what it's time to do? Time to run this kingdom to the motherfucking ground. I'm gonna do all the bad decisions. The only roadblock I see is with the gold making machine. It's going to like give me money every day. So I just have to get into enough debt to where we go bankrupt and then everybody dies. I wonder if you can speed run it. I think I did literally every good dialogue. So, I don't know. Some people... I think the shortest person I saw beat it in like 70, and then I saw one person say 50. So no, I do not have the world record PB. Okay, so now, Antioch. Antioch. We're gonna make everybody angry. Butler. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, my lady. Might I have the rest of the day off? No. Mm -mm. You can stay here. Oh dear, I told my friends I'd be there. You know who else will stay here? The non-followers, because everybody, we are another 30 minutes in the stream, so if you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Can we get some new followers today? Smile. Okay, anti arc I'm an evil queen. I've gone rogue. Boots. Looks like he wants somebody to pat his belly. I hate cats. Mm -mm. He sounds so sad. Sneaky girl. Hey there. I heard you need a champion to wield that dragon blade. I'm pretty good with swords. Can I take that thing and show your, our friend the dragon a thing or two? No, you're not the right hero. Mm -mm. Aw, what is it? You don't trust me? Yeah, because you're a crook. A fiend. Butler. You've been drinking quite a bit of tea, madam. Might I upgrade you to the good stuff? No. I'm a broken. Mm -mm. No? Another time, then. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? No. Mm -mm. I see. It's understandable that you don't want to take the risk. Farewell. Okay, honestly, the plaza might put me in debt if it takes too long. The Mason Central Plaza renovation is progressing, bringing more attention to the city's downtown area. The Dragon Blade lies useless without a master. Some are beginning to lose hope that the dragon will ever be slain. The Jester continues to amaze the court with a combination of his skill and his ever-increasing special effects budget. <laughs> Day 62 complete. Population plus 3, happiness plus 15, and wealth minus 100. Ooh! Mason. Our Central Plaza restoration project is at last complete. Thank you for your patience, madam. Our downtown area has never looked so beautiful, I must say. Damn, my kingdom is beautiful. Grandma. 
Those new speakers the builders put in are too loud. I can't hear myself think when that music plays. I'm going to be circulating a petition to have them removed. Those scientists have gone too far. Old people, am I right? Monsieur Spirit. Good day, madam. Do you require any haunting services? For a small price, I'll scare some people for you. Yes, make them all run away. Ha ha ha. Why do you want to scare people away? Oh, well, I'll do it. I want this kingdom to burn. Mulder. I couldn't uncover anything. I was being followed. Too risky. Did you see anyone follow me out of the castle? Yes, I did. Mm -hmm. What? Why didn't you tell me? Very suspicious. Huh. Nothing was different there. Scientist. Hello, hello. The Council of Science has developed a new potion and needed testing. May I have permission to conduct a test with a willing participant? No. Mm -mm. Too risky, you think? Perhaps you're right. Hmm. The gold generating machine spits out a small patch of coins in the night. Day 63 complete. Population minus one, happiness plus four, and wealth plus 15. Okay, everybody. I will play for another 30 minutes to see if we can kill this kingdom. All we need is the dragon to come back and say, I will eat everybody. That is what we need. Wizard, I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Can I give it a try? Yes. Kill me. Damn it. In game, sorry. <laughs> I wanted the wizard to kill my followers. Oh, interesting. Seems like it went well for you. Boots. Can I have some food? No. Sad. Grandma. Hello, sweetie. Can I borrow a coin for the newspaper? No. Look under your couch cushion. It's just a single coin. Oh. Oh my. Gardener. Some nasty bugs have made a home out of our garden. Can we have some gold to hire an exterminator? Okay, so I, I'm, I think I'm either going to do decisions that merc people or spend a lot of money. So yes, if it's spending money, I will do it. Mm -hmm. Thank you, madam. Our plants are safe. Because I know if your town gets very unhappy or if you're broke, it's game over, I think. Royal advisor. The owners of the tavern are making piles of gold and wish to share some with you. That's just a campaign donation. That way I don't enact any... What was it called when you ban alcohol? I forgot. The gold generating machine spits out a small patch of coins in the night. Day 64 complete. Population plus 20, happiness plus 6, and wealth plus 112. Where's the dragon to kill us all? Boots. Looks like he wants somebody to pat his belly. No, I hate him. Mm -hmm. Winston. Hey, uh, I think there's something going on in the sewers. I've been hearing some weird sounds. I can go investigate if you want. No, I want everybody mm -hmm. to die. Aw, oh, man. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dude, stop giving me money! Oh, interesting. Seems like it went well for you. Thank you, Mac. I appreciate it. Boots. Looks like he wants someone to pat his belly. No! Mm -mm. I want this cat to be sad. Little Fang. You feeling spooky today? Yes! Mm -hmm. Heck yeah, let the blood flow. <laughs> Lewis was giving out free cake in the market today, much to the citizens' delight. Oh wait, Lewis was the mouse, right? Day 65 complete. Population plus 19, happiness plus 4, and wealth plus 100. Why is everything going so well? Scientist, 
what is this I hear about a petition to remove the speakers? I say, I say, it's quite upsetting. Have you heard about this? I had no idea people were so upset. What do you think? Do you support the petition? Should we remove, remove the speakers? No, keep them angry. You're right. The citizens just don't appreciate the brilliance of this project. Surely in time they will come to enjoy it. Why did nobody get angry? Skelly. Any mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fee if you're interested. Nah, I'm good. Mm -mm. Are you suggesting you know the secrets of the universe already? Yeah, I'm the queen. I'm the smartest and the richest. Gardener. Some nasty bugs have made a home out of our garden. Can we have some gold to hire an exterminator? Yes, of course. I love spending money. Thank you, madam. Our plants are safe. Sneaky girl. Want me to steal from the rich and give it to you? Not just the rich. I'll steal from whoever, basically. No. Because mm -mm. I don't need money. Taking the high road, huh? I'll see you around. Royal advisor. Our road network is expanding and is in need of maintenance. Is there room in the budget? Of course there is. Mm -hmm. Of course there is. Good. We must not let our roadways be fall into it. We must not let our roadways fall into disrepair. Okay, I'm regretting this gold generating machine. The gold generating machine spits out a small bunch of coins in the night. Citizens are beginning to get sick due to contamination in the water supply. How did that happen? Oh, the sewer. Ghostly figures are seen drifting around the graveyard. The spirits of Peter have become angry. I wonder what's gonna happen now. Are we gonna be haunted? Day 66 complete. Population plus zero and happiness plus zero. Wealth minus 105. Peanut, he's got a shiny coin? No, if you showed up your ass. He looks sad. Ha <laughs> I'm evil now. Little Fang. You feeling spooky today? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Heck yeah, let the blood flow. Grandma. Um, hello, sweetie. Can I borrow a coin for the paper? No! Mm -mm. Oh my! Skelly. Any mysteries afoot? I could do some snooping for a small fee if you're interested. No. Mm -mm. Are you suggesting you know all the secrets of the universe already? Yeah, I'll be. I've come this far. Monsieur Spirit. Good day, madam. Do you require any haunting services? For a small price, I'll scare some people for you. Yes, I do. Peace, I too, smile. Mm -hmm. Why do you want to scare people away? Oh well, I'll do it. A shiny golden statue pops out of the gold generating machine. Looks like it's pretty valuable. The gold generating machine spits out a small bunch of coins in the night. Day 67 complete. Population minus two, happiness minus two, and wealth plus 75. Royal Advisor. A petition to bring the circus to town is circulating. Could attract tourists. Are you interested? No. Mm -mm. All work and no play, huh? That's right. No dilly-dallying here. Fisherman. My boat's all fixed up thanks to you. It's about time I started paying you back on your loan. Oh, he paid it all back. Good man. Scientist. Hello, hello. The Council of Science has developed a new potion in need of testing. May you have permission to conduct a test with a willing participant? Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. Very good, yes, yes. I will report back to you with news of the potion's effects. Please be a potion that kills everybody. Royal Advisor. The owners of the tavern are making piles of gold and wish to share some with you. I don't want money. I want... <gasps> Mortimer. Um, yes, hello. One of your fishermen has been bothering me. I demand a villager as, um, a sacrifice. Yes. 
If I say no, I hope he comes back and eats everyone. Mm -mm. Oh, huh. You've angered me now, madam. Watch your back. <laughs> There's a party going on at the tavern tonight. The citizens rejoice, singing and dancing together into the night. Day 68 complete. Population plus zero, happiness minus three, and wealth plus 115. Guys, funny number incoming! Grandma. Um, hello, sweetie. Can I borrow a coin for the paper? No! Mm -mm. Oh my! Butler. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, milady. Might I have the rest of the day off? No, you've gone to like mm -mm. five parties this month. You're crazy. Oh dear, I told my friends I'd be there. Monsieur Monton. Demand for my services is through the roof. May I have your permission to raise my prices? No. Mm -mm. We could be making so much more gold, though. Witch. There's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slay them for a few gold coins if you want. No. Mm -mm. Fine. Let your people get bullied by goblins, then. Mason. Can I trouble you for a sandwich? Surely the cost of one sandwich is nothing to a great queen like you. No. Mm -hmm. Starve. So stingy. A shiny golden statue pops out of the gold generating machine. Looks like it's pretty valuable. Music rings out into the night, causing a few particularly ener energetic citizens to start an impromptu dance party in the streets. Man, everybody's so happy now! Spooky spirits are haunting the city. Spread bad luck to the citizens. <laughs> Very good. Day 69 complete. Population plus zero. Happiness minus 13. And wealth plus 60. Night. My lady, I wish to embark on a treacherous quest. No, you gotta stay here and protect mm -hmm. me. Alas, I shall, remain, I shall remain here at home, my lady. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? No. Mm -mm. I see. It's understandable that you don't want to take the risk. Farewell. Royal advisor. I noticed you speaking with that wizard again. Is he bothering you? I can have him banished from the city if you don't wish to be pestered with his magic offerings. What do you say? Ban him! Mm -hmm. Very well. I'll inform the guards not to let him back into the city. Scientist. Our potion test has resulted in a bit of a good fortune. Well, in a way, that is. You see, the test subject turned to gold upon drinking it. A moral failure indeed, but a financial success at the least. <laughs> Dude... Based Angie. <laughs> That's hilarious. I'm gonna have to save that for my arsenal. That's pretty good. <laughs> 1 800, none of your business. That's so good. Little Fang. Hello, friend. Get a gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I got something good. I see fame and fortune for you. You're still alive? Hi, Kim. Yeah. We beat the main story, but I'm, I'm trying to kill this kingdom, but nobody's fucking dying. The gold generating machine spits out a small bunch of coins in the night. Kim has a disease? Monk a W. Don't, don't get near me. A wave of dark magical energy passed through the city during the night, causing spooky nightmares for many citizens. Day 70 complete. Population minus 2. Happiness plus 0. And wealth plus 120. Little Timmy. Mwah, can I have a coin? A gold coin? 
No. Mm -mm. Go get a job. If you're 11, you can work at McDonald's in, like, Ohio. Wah. Oh. Poor Timmy. Which? There's a bunch of goblins in the lower quarter. I'll slay him for a few good coins if you want. No. Mm -mm. Have them kill our people. Fine. Let your people get bullied by goblins, then. Madame Abiel. I accidentally stayed up all night eating candies. Can I have some gold to go to the doctor? No. Mm -mm. Dude, Mac, you don't... <laughs> okay, Mac, you don't gotta share that shit. Weird. Yeah, go to the doctor, Kim. Mac, you know... You just violated HEPA. What the fuck, Mac? Kim can sue you. Oh dear, this tummy ache of mine is quite bad. Mercury, might I have some gold to make an offering at the ocean shrine? Yeah, take all of my money. Please take all of it, all of it, all of it. Thank you. The ocean spirits will surely be pleased. Monsieur Manton. Citizens from far and wide come to visit my barber shop. Would you like a fresh cut, madame? Free of charge. No. Mm -mm. Your haircuts are bad. Why is that positive? Sticking with your style, I see. You're a very fashionable king. Is someone had a Chucky doll in their passenger seat? Why? Why? That's weird. That's weird. I think if somebody is into dolls, red flag. A shiny golden statue pops out of the gold generating machine. Looks like it's pretty valuable. The gold generating machine spits out a small patch of coins in the night. Day 71 complete. Population plus zero, happiness minus eight, and wealth minus 20. Little Fang. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see. Fame and fortune for you. Little Timmy. Mwah, can I have a coin? A gold coin? No. Mm -mm. Get a job. Mwah. Military general, the town we made an alliance with is in trouble. Should we send soldiers to assist them? Yes, that way they kill our people. Mm -hmm. Yes, minus ten. Of course, we promised we would protect them. Shameless plug? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. A shameless plug? Hmm, peace I too? Hmm. What? What is, what is this? Is this peace in art.myshopify.com? Holy moly, guys, I updated some of the sections. I, I rearranged some of the words, so go check it out! Exclamation shop in chat! Um, new drops coming out this month, everybody, later this month, in a week and a half. So bookmark my website, peaceandart.myshopify.com, right now! Also, I will be doing a giveaway stream, so make sure you're watching on launch day. Um, date to be determined. I'll post on Twitter. Smile! Oops. Very nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling better today. Show my review. I have to review your review first. What if you put, like, a slur in it? You were like, what if this painting is so fucking good? Thank you, Angie, for redeeming. Yeah, so I have my website. I also have separate social media accounts for my art. So go follow. Oh shit, I almost knocked my crown. You should see me in a crown. Oh wait, no, that's a Billie Eilish song. For some reason, I was thinking Taylor Swift. That was totally off. Yeah, I'm feeling better today. I got rest Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. We, we saw a movie Friday with my sister. But I think biking killed me. I might have to do biking like... I think I'll do twice a week, and then once 
Because what I've noticed is like anytime I have to do any like laborious activity, so that could be like biking, um, doing errands where I have to like do a lot of walking, I have to like give myself a day in between. So biking every day for four days fucked me up. So I think I'm gonna like I'm I'm still doing daily walks. I can still walk, but I think I have to do biking like either twice a week or every other day. That's fine. I gotta ease into it. Okay, Sultan. I've got a business proposition for you in your tiny little town. Are you interested? No. Mm -mm. Hmm. You're lost, friend. How am I gonna make this game end? I want I want the game to end. Citizens from far and wide come to visit my barbershop. Would you like a fresh cut, madame? Free of charge. Yes. Mm -hmm. I wanna look ugly. Of course you do. You look dashing. Why did it give me positive that? Uh, either both responses give me good merits. That's not good. The gold generating machine spits out a small patch of coins in the night. Day 72 complete. Population minus 10. Happiness plus 6. And wealth plus 70. Does this game have an end? No. Wait, can I just start a new game? I'll start a new game and I'll just, I'll I'll speed run death. That's what I'll do cuz just looking at how much money I have I I have, I have way too much money. It's I have way too much. And my happiness is way too high. I don't know why you didn't. My brain is too big for my head, okay? I'm very silly sometimes. Okay, I'm going to I have to open up a new window cuz I can't there's no option to save the game, so I have to close it and reopen it. <laughs> your brain is too small for your head. Is it like jostling around when you go for a walk? <laughs> Tee. -hee. Is it back? Oh yeah, it's back. So. We're gonna start a new game, and I'm gonna speed run to see how fast I lose. Damn, day 72. New game, everybody. R.I.P. Kingdom V1. Let us welcome in Kingdom V2. I'm gonna kill everyone. Anti-arc begins now. Royal Advisor. My lady, I'll help you rule your kingdom. But you have to make the tough choices. Can you say yes or no, understand? You can be a king? Yeah, you can choose between king or queen. I do not understand. Mm -mm. Very funny. Just give people their answers, okay? Our city's still very small right now, but it has the potential to grow. Perhaps one day you'll have a bustling metropolis and you'll be invited to join the Council of Crowns. For now, all you need to concern yourself with is keeping the citizens happy and growing our population. Do your best, madam. Okay, honestly, building a city in 60 days is kind of crazy. Wizard. I was just passing through and thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Care to give it a try? No. Mm -mm. I see understandable that you don't want to take the risk. Farewell. Skelly. Do you find me humorous? No. Mm -mm. Ah, forget it then. <laughs> Georgie. Hey, bud. Can't flip a coin with me. Hence, I give you a bunch of gold tails, I take a bunch of your people's souls. Why not? All that's on the line is my lives of my citizens. Mm -hmm. Fuck! Now <laughs> you got me. It's heads. Enjoy your gold. Damn it. Chester. I accidentally ate some of your folks out front. Can I just pay you back for gold? No. Mm -mm. Well, I ate them, so... Too late. Can we have Chester come back every day? Day one complete. Population minus five. Happiness plus zero and wealth plus 300. The Sultan. I got a business proposition for you in your tiny little town. Are you interested? No. Mm -hmm. I hate globalism. Hmm. You're lost, friend. 
When I'm friends, why are you even calling me that? Cringe. Night. My lady, I wish to embark upon a treacherous quest. No. Mm -mm. Alas, I shall remain here at home, lady. Butler. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, my lady. Might I have the rest of the day off? No. Mm -mm. Oh dear. I told my friends I'd be there. Military General. We captured some foes on the battlefield. Shall we bring them home and put them to work? No. Mm -mm. I understand. However, we need to do something with them. You can... Dispose of them. I know you have your ways. Shall we ransom the captured foes off for a bit of gold? No. Mm -mm. No. I'm at a loss of what to do with them. Might I put them in the dungeons then? No. Mm -mm. Madame, there must be something I can do. No. I'm going to have to deal with these captives myself. Maybe I can train them and make use of them. Yes, make them vigilantes. The guards confiscated some gold that I haven't found. Can I have it back? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thanks. I knew you'd understand. She's lying. She's capping. She robbed me. But I love that. Day two complete. Population plus five. Happiness minus three and wealth minus 25. Wait. The population decreased at the end of the day. Look. It went minus one instead of plus one. <laughs> it's working. Drummer. But I'm but I'm but I'm Yeah, you like my rhythm, bruh. No, I hate it. Mm -mm. But I'm shh. Bummer. Yeah, go away. Royal Advisor. The people have started a petition to ban cannibals in the city. Should we do it? No. Mm -mm. Sticking up for cannibals? How admirable. Little Fang. Hello, friend. Can to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see fame and fortune for you. Jester. Ooh, might I borrow some gold for some new juggling balls? No. Mm -mm. Oh, no. Sneaky girl. Hey, you helped me out before. I brought you something, just don't ask where I came from. Will you accept my gift? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here you go. Better if you don't ask questions. Day three complete. Ooh, three people left. That's good. Population plus zero. Happiness minus three and wealth plus 75. I think it'll take like 20 days. Wizard, I was just passing through and I thought you might like some magic. Anything could happen. Can I give it a try? No, you're bothering mm -hmm. me. I see. It's understandable that you don't want to take the risk. Farewell. Royal Advisor, I noticed you speaking with that wizard again. Is he bothering you? You can have him banished from the city if you don't want to be pestered with his magic offerings. What do you say? Ban him. Mm -hmm. Very well. I'll inform the guards not to let, let, let him back into the city. You know who won't, who else won't be let back in? The non-subs, because everybody, we are four hours in the stream. So it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for people's prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a prime available. Oh, thank you for hanging out today, Angie. It was a pleasure seeing you and chatting today. Hope you have a good one. Thank you for hanging out. Bye, Angie. Dude, this looks so bad. It's so big. Oh, no. Okay, back to it. I think we can get the ending, or bad ending, rather, in like 20 days. The all-seeing eye. It's just staring at me. Does it want something? Go away. Mm -mm. 
What just happened? I feel happy. Huh. Witch. I've got a friend from witch school looking to move to town. Can I get a couple gold to help her move in? No. Mm-mm. Jeez, how shellfish! Forget I even asked. It's cool how we're getting different dialogue. Skelly. Any mysteries afoot? I can do some snooping for a small fee if you're interested. No. Mm -mm. I'm good. Are you suggesting you know all the secrets of the universe already? Yeah. I'm smart. Okay, if you hear me, type 37, 37, 37. 37. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I was gonna make a D's nuts joke, but that was that would have been inappropriate. Okay, back to work. Why is this happening? It's it's OBS. Okay, back to work. Huh? Kim, huh? A wave of dark magical energy passed through the city during the night, causing spooky nightmares for many citizens. Population plus zero, happiness plus one, and wealth plus zero. Royal Advisor. Some villagers are threatening to leave unless we pay them a sum of gold. Should we listen to their demands? I hate UBI. I'm a capitalist, not a socialist. Mm -mm. Leave, then. I see. We'll let them go, then. Winston. Hey, uh, you think you could tell people to stop calling me slime ball? It hurts my feelings. No, I love bullying. Bullying is fun for everyone. Mm -mm. Oh man. Boots. Can I have some food? No. Mm -mm. Sad. Georgie. Hey bud, get a flip a coin with me. Heads, I give you a bunch of gold tails. I take a bunch of your people's souls. That sounds fun. Stop giving me money! Hey, <laughs> you got me. It's heads. Enjoy your gold. Damn it. Jester. Oh, oh, might I borrow some gold for new juggling balls? No. Mm -mm. Oh, no. No way, Jose. Day five complete. Population minus six, happiness minus nine, and wealth plus 302. People are sad and the city is shrinking. Little Timmy. Hi, little Timmy. Nice to meet ya. You like ice cream? No, I hate ice cream. I like sorbet. Mm -mm. What? Impossible! <laughs> Sneaky girl. Want me to steal from the rich and give it to you? Not just the rich, I'll steal from whoever, basically. Yes. Mm -hmm. Look how math that made everybody. <laughs> they won't even know what hit them. Chester. You ever see a treasure chest do a backflip? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Really? I don't believe you. <laughs> He's like, you're capping. Royal advisor. There's a petition going around to open up borders to the neighboring town. What do you say? No. Mm -mm. I think some people might be leaving us for them. Good. We don't need them. Only...
This might be end game. Everybody, get ready to say I was here. End game, end game. Dragon, boo. Give me your gold or I'll eat your towns, people. You know what? I don't care. No. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'm gonna go eat some folks then. I thought he was gonna eat everybody. Population minus 35. Happiness minus 6. Wealth plus 50. People are sad and the city is shrinking. <laughs> well, he got two little cottages now. Blacksmith. I'm a blacksmith and I'd like to set up shop here. I can pay my own way. I just need your permission. What do you say? No. Mm -mm. Really? You got nothing to lose here. Timmy. Mwah, can I? Can I have a coin? A gold coin? No. Mm -mm. Get a job. Mwah. Monsieur Spirit. Good day, madam. Do you require any haunting services? For a small price, I'll scare some people for you. Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. We do a little bit of trolling. Why do you want to scare people away? Oh well, I'll do it. Sneaky girl. We're pals, right? Think you can find a home for my friend? He's between places right now, you could say. No. Mm -mm. Really? I thought you were cool. It's interesting the dialogue changed between the her, right? Name's Mulder. If you want to know the truth about everything, you're going to want to hire me. No. Mm -mm. You're not ready for the truth, that's what it is. Day 7 complete. Population minus 1. Happiness minus 3. Wealth minus 5. We also lost another 9. Population. We're at 29. Oh no. We're going to need to do some repopulating. If you catch my drift. Wink. Little fang. Hello, friend. Can you gaze into my magic vampire crystal? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see. Fame and fortune for you. Royal advisor. There's a very stinky kid running around the streets. Should we force her to have a bath? Yes, she's staying. Mm -hmm. Glad you agree. She won't be happy, though. Butler. There's a party I'd like to go to this evening, milady. Might I have the rest of the day off? No. Mm -hmm. You need to request time off two weeks in advance. Oh dear. I told my friends I'd be there. That's what my neighbors said about me. Uh-oh. Take a shower and stop playing Valorant. Grandma. Oh. Hello, sweetie. Can I borrow a coin for the paper? No. Mm -hmm. Oh my... I'm greedy. Look how rich I am. Military General. One of our prisoners has escaped. May I have some gold to offer a reward for her recapture? No. Mm -mm. Forget it. They're probably all the way out of the city by now. Yeah, if they're not in the city, then it's not our problem. The training of captured recruits has resulted in a few new soldiers joining our ranks. Okay, that's actually pretty good. Day 8 complete. Population plus 2. Happiness plus 0. Wealth plus 50. Oh my god, we're at 19 people. Uh-oh. Everybody's just leaving. Pancake. This cat seems slightly magical. Not sure what it wants, though. Leave. Mm -mm. Hmm. Monsieur Espirit. Hmm. You call this a castle? I don't, actually. Mm -mm. You should be more confident. I'm not. I'm insecure. That's why I have this pile of coins around me. Mason. I wish to construct a cavern, but I'll need some gold for me to make it happen. I'm taking a considerable amount of gold, like a couple hundred at least. What do you think? No. Mm -mm. I don't like drunkards. Man. Guess I'll cancel our plans. Witch. The spirits are appeased right now, but perhaps we should grant them an offering of gold. I know the spirit would always appreciate gold, and it might prevent them from haunting us in the future. What do you say? 200 gold would make a decent offering. 
No. Mm -mm. I want to be haunted. Nothing for now, then. I'll let you know if anything changes with the spirit world. Royal Advisor. Villagers are complaining about garbage in the streets. Shall we hire workers to clean it up? No, let them spew in their soilage. Mm -mm. The, villi the villagers will be stinking mad. Day 9 complete. Population plus 1, happiness minus 3, and wealth plus 0. Oh my god, we're at 7 people. Oh, this is bad, this is bad. Alien. You haven't been talking to Skelly, have you? I have. Mm -hmm. Here, take this. I was never here, okay? All seeing eye. It's just staring at me. Does it want something? Mm -mm. What just happened? I feel sad. You like the alien voice? Yeah, I think it's kind of funny. I don't know how I do the voices. I wish I could. If I practice, I probably could do. Like, impressions. Wait, I can do Mickey. I can do Mickey. Ready? <laughs> That's the only part I can do, though. <laughs> Royal Advisor. The Guild of Pineapple Traders offers you a gift, madame. Will you accept it? No, I hate presents. Mm -hmm. They appreciate your support, nonetheless. Chicken. I think it's just here to pay a visit. Should we, should we leave it be? No, burn it. Mm -mm. Whoa, that thing is dangerous. Minus one. Georgie, hey bud, get a flip of coin with me. Hence, I give you a bunch of gold tails, I take a bunch of your people's souls. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Everybody left. You have nobody left to rule over. Plus, press space to play again. Damn! It just ends like that? I thought there was gonna be like a revolt. Everybody just left. It's like that one bully on the playground. Once everybody stops playing with them, then their social life is gone. Damn! That's the end. Bad ending. Wait, how many days did it take? I didn't miss It was like less than 10 days, right? Somebody go back in the VOD and see. But dang! Finally, it's over. You know what? It's time for me to... Okay, it's time for me to... Turn in the crown, everybody. It It's not meant for me. It's also way too small for my head, so it wasn't gonna work out anyway. But there we go! Dude, my voice is fucked. That was a lot of talking. But that was fun. I didn't realize this game was free. If I knew this game was free, then I would have played it, like, a lot sooner. But I, I just totally blanked. I thought I had... Because it's free online. Because <coughs> I thought it was on console, but it's not. Okay, let's get some music on for you guys. And we get to do calligraphy. Thank you for redeeming, Mac. That was longer than I thought I would stream for, but I feel fine. I'm just, I'm just hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry. Do I need to beg my queen for a sandwich? Also, did anybody get their sketch cards in the mail yet? I mailed them out on Tuesday and Wednesday, I think. Because I mailed out Max, Kobobos, and Kim's.
Your favorite blue? Okay. Oh, we had a lot of people redeem. Yeah, I'm hoping to stream tomorrow, too. Just so I can make up for the hours lost this past week. I'm either gonna do... I think I'm gonna do a one-off game. And I'll save Zelda for later in the week. But it just depends on how well I rest tonight. Hopefully I get more rest in. Yeah, I honestly think it's also just stress, like, just, like, the stress of graduating in general. And, like, also, because, like, my disability benefits, it's, like, a 95% yes. But it's still, like, a 5%, it could be a no that I get denied. And if I get denied, I'm, like, fucked. I'm, like, like, I'll be fine. My sister is, like, supporting me and is willing to support me. But still, it's very sad. It'll be very sad if I get denied when I have a fucking diagnosis. It'd be, it'd be bullshit. Anyway. What type of pizza did you get? Oh. <laughs> so, okay. I tweeted out, like, as a joke, like, partially, like, sad posting, but also jokey. I bought a frozen pizza, and the pizza was only this big, okay? Only slightly bigger than my, my big brain head, okay? It was only this big. And I bet if you guys saw the size of the pizza, because, like, the box was this big. The box was huge. The box was, like, as long as the painting is tall. But the, the pizza was so fucking small. It also shrunk in the oven. Somehow. It was a garlic parmesan. Classic. Safeway branded... Safeway branded pizza. And then I added um, extra shredded Monterey Jack on top. And it was delicious. No regrets. But, <laughs> cause on days where I feel lazy, I don't, like if it's a dish where I don't have to put it onto a plate, I'll just eat it over the cutting board. Why am I writing purple? The person requested purple, not their name, jeez. Um, so, like, I didn't, like, put my pizza on a plate. I was eating it, so I was just, like, eating it right off the pan that I baked it on. So, as I was eating it, I was like, man, this is... It was also a thin crust. And y'all know thin crust is not nearly as filling as a normal crust. So, yes, I ate a whole pizza... You don't like thin crust? I love thin crust. I like the texture of it. I think it's- oh shit, I fucked up that zero. I think it's because a lot of the times, um... With like a regular dough crust, it's not like crispy enough. It's like kind of soggy usually if you don't eat it right away. Gentle reminder, if you want me to write your name, all you need to do is use your channel points or donate to the channel! Any redeemers? 
What's the best pizza you ever had? Hmm. I mean, do y'all remember the pizza you guys ordered on stream? That one was surprisingly pretty good. I think pizza time is pretty solid. They've gotten fairly expensive though recently. No, I liked it. I think it's because it was better than I anticipated. So then, therefore, I remember it to be like pretty decent, like good. Also, gentle reminder, everybody, I know streams have been sporadic recently, but hopefully I'll be more consistent during summer. But if you do want to keep updated with me, or if you want to see funny jokes sometimes, go follow my Twitter. I usually do tweets right before I go live, that way you guys can hang out in offline chat for a little bit. It is at Peacein17 on Twitter. Okay, we have one name left, everybody. Final name of the day. Final name. <laughs> this is my favorite blue. Like this sky blue but this pen is busted okay everybody that was the last name last name everybody last call if you want my original name all you need to do is use your channel points or donate to the channel And if you are new here, follow. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Last call. Dude, my hair is whack. Okay, and we're done, we're done. Okay, I would like to thank everybody for watching. Any chatters, lurkers, thank you all for hanging out today for a bonus, bonus, I guess sub ghost stream for the weekend. Once again, I apologize for the inconsistency. Hopefully, I'll be feeling better. You know, life just happens sometimes. But that's okay. Um, I had fun. Thank you to any chatters, lurkers. Thank you all for hanging out. Um, I, I plan on going live again tomorrow. It's either going to be a one-off game or a sub only depending on how i feel so yeah i'll see you guys later before i go if you could so i'm just getting ready to put my hair up it's annoying me if you could follow my offline social media i have a twitter instagram and a tiktok go follow all three if you're a real fan follow my ig i need more ig cloud everybody i need more cloud also, I am uploading the normal shorts and a special edited clips from stream on my YouTube clip channel. Okay, don't call me mom, you weirdo. What the fuck? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Do I need to make mom a block term? Dude, I don't stream for three days and the weirdos come out. 
Okay. <laughs> um, sub to the Clips channel. It's youtube.com slash at peace in 17 clips. Go subscribe. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye bye. Dude, I can't. Wait, I feel like Kim has called me mom before. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just. I'm channeling that, like, evil queen energy. Dude, it's 6 p.m. Holy fuck. Frick. I use it as a funny saying. I know it's endearment. No, you should you should just call me Queen instead. Every time I see it, it never lands with you. I like to play hard to get is what I'll say. Smile. I'm also just really inconsistent because my, my memory is totally fucked. I mean, how long have you been chatting, Kim? Almost six months? Uh oh. <laughs> I mean, you would think I would get your bits by now. Yeah, I'll rest up. I'm gonna go eat a fat dinner. Also, my sister bought um, pizza pockets today. Nobody tell her, but I might eat some. Okay, bye guys. I'll see you tomorrow. If not, then I'll see you Monday or Tuesday. Bye-bye. Thank y'all for hanging out. Bye-bye.